friends. Oh, I'm so excited to have you. Thanks so much for being here. The beginning of our Thursday stream stream. <laughs> My days have been incredibly off this week. Um, I, I just constantly feel myself second guessing, like, what day is it? Is it is it Tuesday? Is it Wednesday? Is it Thursday? Yesterday, I was convinced it was Thursday for a majority of the day. Um, but here we are. We made it. Meant to do this yesterday and completely forgot. Hope this helps with the partner points, lovely. It does so, so much, Snarkinist. I can't begin to say how much I appreciate you. You were so kind to... Um, give that referral to us yesterday for the raid, so thanks so much again for that. And for the three-month resub, um, for anybody who doesn't know, I have been trying to get into the Twitch Plus program, and for that we need to get like a certain amount of subscriber points for three months consecutively, um, paid sub points. So that three-month resub really, really does help. Thank you for that. How are you doing? I hope that you're great. Also, uh, Brian, welcome in. I hope you're having a nice day. Who else uh, have I not said hello to yet? I didn't get to say hello to a lot of beans. I was just kind of whew, rushing around um, uh, today, getting ready for Shrim Shrim, because today uh, is one of those days where we're having a Shrim Shrim on Twitch and on YouTube. So hello, Twitch. Hello, YouTube. So nice to have you here. Thanks for watching, no matter where you are. <laughs> Jenny, welcome in too. I hope that you're great. Ace, nice to see you. Hello, Molly, welcome in. We got Jacob in here too. Jacob, you uh, chilling while waiting for your delayed train? I hope it goes by quickly. Bless your heart, friend. Coming at y'all live from Union Station, Kansas City Wi-Fi. Woohoo! Jacob, now that's an exciting stream. <laughs> Hi, Thimble. Nice to see you. Joe, welcome in too. I hope you're having a great day. Jenna, Jenna, how are you feeling, friend? I've been thinking of you, ma'am. I, um, I was like, think of like messaging you this morning but I was like oh I know she's been sicky and I don't know if she really really will I don't want to feel like you know I'm pressuring her to like to, to message and respond if she's sleeping so I was like well if she stops in stream today let's ask her how she is <laughs> but I hope that you've been okay I hope you got some rest last night Bear, nice to see you how are you sin welcome into and sin not redeeming uh a little something do I see that correctly? I think I do. So our friend Sin over there, guys, may or may not have redeemed a treat for Finn. Hey, buddy. Um, would you like a treat? My fan's going a little bit crazy right now. Let me angle that. That's better. Um, I know what you look very seepy right now. <laughs> got a little sick this morning. I think he ate too fast, but he's, uh, he's doing better now. And I think, I think maybe a little treat will perk him up. <laughs> you like this? Oh, I think he would. He's licking his chops. <laughs> this treat here is from our friend, and There you go, buddy. There he goes. Ah. In. Thanks for giving a treat to the boy. <laughs> we also have Chad in here. Chad, nice to see you. Thanks for the kind words. I appreciate it. Hope you're having a great day. Also, Sin, thanks for that seven stream streak. Much appreciated there, too. Susie, nice to see you. How's it going? I hope you're having a great day. Java, welcome in. Java, thanks for the kind words. I always love those emotes so, so much. <laughs> Just rolling through your workday, Snarkinist. I uh, hope you're doing well, too. I am doing okay, thanks for asking. So grateful to have you here during your workday. I hope we can help it go by a little bit quicker. Uh, 25 points to go uh, for a 60 out of 40. It might technically even be less than that now, because like this has not been updating like during stream. So, um, hang on, what does it even say right now? <laughs> Let me check and see. <laughs> Because um, I know with uh, with our, our wonderful friend Snarkinist, it did increase it by one more. So, yep, yep, you're exactly right, Rob. You already took that into account, of course, because you're a smart cookie. Um, so yeah, just with uh, if we can get 25 more paid subs this month, then I will have like one month down toward my three months that I need 
or plus program and that would enable yours truly to be able to make more from subs at no additional cost to the viewer so yeah that, that would be really really helpful <laughs> rusty nice to see you how's it going i hope you're great anisa nice to see you too welcome in i hope you're having a great day <clears throat> what's up y'all it's your boy it's jacob j and this is my waiting on the train stream <laughs> i would watch it hey you you poked me <laughs> You can always uh, shoot me a message. Okay, I'm doing better. Good. Still feeling rough, but back at work today. Are you really, Jenna? Gosh, bless your heart. I was hoping you were getting an extra day of rest. Hope you're not pushing yourself too much. Uh, oh, but you are thankfully just from home. That's good, at least. I'm, I'm, I'm glad that you're at home, not going anywhere. But you make sure to take care of yourself, ma'am. Don't make me, don't make me come over there. <laughs> Hi, Sherrit. Nice to see you. How are you? I hope that you're having a really nice day. Welcome in, friend. Head scritchies for Finn. All the head scritchies for Finn. And Susie, you're doing okay? Good, good. Been a productive day? Oh, that's awesome. So happy to hear it. I don't know if we got a... Um... A boop. This for our friend Susie, aka Melon Bubbles. But just in case we didn't, I'm gonna drop one there. She's um, a wonderful streamer. Plays a lot of comfy, cozy games as well. So I don't know, uh, Susie, if you had this game on your radar. If anybody here had uh, the game on their radar, but I, I've had it on my radar for a while, and um, I'm really quite excited to uh, to play it today. So um, we thankfully got a key from uh, the publishers Nacon. So big thank you to them. And. Um, I, so a lot of you guys know I love my cozy games and um, yeah this one apparently it's kind of just like where you're growing your own garden and and yeah I'm, I'm excited to, to test it out with you all. Uh, is it Lothari? Did I say it right? Welcome in. Hi I'm new here. Welcome in. I'm one of the Garden Life developers. Looking forward to watching a first playthrough. Oh gosh now I'm a little bit embarrassed. I hope I don't disappoint. <laughs> It really looks like a lovely game, so I'm excited to try it out and grateful to have you here. Um, is it um, Yunda? Welcome in too. I hope that you're great. And um, Tasty Apple Pie. I like the name. Really like your hair. Thanks so much. I appreciate it. I hope you're having a nice day too. It does look very cozy. It really does. So without uh, further ado then, should we, should we go ahead and... Um, I was about to say, should we go ahead and open up the game? I probably should have checked for like an update beforehand, but thankfully it's only like one gigabyte and it's going really quickly. So <laughs> friends, how's your day going? How's the weather? <laughs> also, I hope you guys had a great rest of your um, Wednesday evening yesterday. Yesterday on stream, we played some more Nightingale and that's been like a really beautiful game. Very unique in a lot of its mechanics. I've been enjoying that. Um, so, uh, but yeah, yesterday after I sh our stream, I had to end a little bit early because I had a meeting um, where I got some more information about something exciting coming up that I can't wait to share with you guys in about a week. About a week. So that'll be cool. Um, and, um, then, yeah, yesterday evening, had some cozy time with Mr. Finn, uh, had some leftover vegan pizza. Um, and then in the evening, me and good old Hannah, we played some, uh, some, some games, so that was quite fun. Also, uh, Yunda, thanks for the kind words, too. I appreciate you so much. Uh, is that a cow plushie from Palea? So excited for Garden Life. I've had it on my, uh, wish list on Steam for a very long time. It was the same for me, too, Yunda. So, yes, this is an Ormu from Palea. I'm one of the Palea partners, and they were super kind a while back and sent, um, like, a, a swag bag, if you will, um, of, of some different things, and, uh, the plushie came with it, so that was super nice. Vegan pizza? Okay, subscribed, yes. <laughs> yeah, it had some, um, vegan cheese, of course. Um, some mushrooms, caramelized onions on it. I think what else? Those are the main things, but it was good. It was really good. Joe, yeah, I think it is on PlayStation 2. The only thing that I don't think it's on right now is Switch, but it's coming to Switch, I think, next month. 
That Hannah lady is a lucky one. Oh, shucks, I'm the lucky one. Also, hi, Sonia. Nice to see you, friend. How are you? Hope you're doing well and have a lovely stream. It's already lovely with you here. Have a therapy appointment, so I'll have to leave a lurk. Always appreciate the lurks. Sending you lots of love and well wishes with your therapy appointment. And I hope that it goes well, my friends. Really appreciate you being here. So what I'm going to do, friends, is I'm going to uh, hit play on the game. We'll go on over to, I don't know if it'll be best play on this side or on this side, um, but we'll try on this side. And if I'm covering up stuff, we'll, we'll move on over. Um, and I'm going to like mute the stream first, since I've never loaded up this game. I don't know how loud it's going to be when we first do the thing. I'm just going to mute for a moment and then I'll bring back some, uh, Oh, 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 <laughs> Thank goodness I muted. <laughs> Hang on, let me just remove this for a second. <laughs> okay, all right. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, um, so let's, uh, let's make sure we can have it on the screen. That'd be helpful so you guys can see. Guys, look at this cozy starting screen. Can we talk about this for a second? Oh. Beautiful. Um, I do need to. I'll make it the sound quiet on you guys' side. It's still quite loud for me, so I need to adjust some stuff real quick. Uh, let's bring the master volume real down. Um, let me just leave it at that for a second, then I can bring it back up to for you guys the level that I hear. All right, so this is what I'm hearing right now. Um, oh, what the heck is going on with some love here? Oriana, thank you so much for that seven month resub. I really appreciate the support. I've been vying for the uh, plus program, so thank you. Thank you for your support toward my goal. I really appreciate you. How are you doing? I hope you're great. Excited for this game? Me too. I'm really excited to have you here. Also, um, Ace, thanks so much for dropping that exclamation serenity in chat for our beautiful Hannah Bean. Nobi, nice to see you. How are you? You've been curious about this game too? Me too. Unexpected weighty noises. It wouldn't be a wage dream without some unexpected weighty noises. Just some, just some cozy chaos. <laughs> oh. <Ooh. laughs> All right. So, um, maybe we'll we bring it to like maybe 10. We'll try maybe like 10. See how that is and you know maybe once we get into the game it might be a little bit different but look at this look how beautiful already we haven't even gotten into the game <laughs> um but some things to take in in here hang on I, I am going to switch it on over to this side just for a second so you can see the art over there so i think the um the girl on the left far most is is the main character i guess maybe who we will be because you see her on like the art for the game and all that jazz. There's also like this cute little like grandma lady who looks like a hippie, I love her. Um, there's a handsome bloke in the back. Another beautiful bean um, beside the main character. Uh, we have Gandalf with a huge sunflower, love him. And then a, a, a blonde lady with a beautiful hat. I can't help but notice somebody in the background too. They have like a little bit of like an aura around them. Are they a ghost? I don't know. I don't know, but I'm I'm excited to find out. <laughs> Hi Alexander, welcome in. Uh thank you for streaming our new game. Alexander, are you part of the dev team as well? Yeah, we had a, a, a dev team friend step in just a moment ago, and I'm so grateful um to, to see you guys. Thanks so much for the support here. Really appreciate it. But yeah, I hope that you're having a wonderful day. It's so pretty, isn't it? So yeah, maybe we'll, we'll try on this side since I switched over to show the art. Um, but like I said, if we need to switch on over to the other side again, we can definitely do that. I am. Um, it's nice to meet you, Alexander. Welcome in. Welcome into the strip jam. Getting ghost vibes too? I'm like, we're already like getting some, some sneak peeks at some lore and I'm excited to see what it's going to be all about. How are the um, graphic settings and stuff? mode graphics quality i just i'm tempted to set that at ultra famous last words <laughs> we'll see how that goes <laughs> all right because right now i don't hear my fans going on my pc at all so uh see how it is once we get into the game let's start it up 
And uh, Lolly, the game is coming to Switch, I think, next month, I want to say. Mm, what is a Partner Plus and how can we help you to reach it? Hope that thought. Pandakin, hi, how's it going? Thank you, thank you so much for that raid. We literally just started up the stream. I was just about to start up this new game, so thank you. Thanks so much for coming over. How was your stream? What were you up to today? I ca cash smash meow, Pandakin, of course. A big man welcome into and mod friends. Thanks for doing that shout out for Pandakin. Um, Pandakin, I hope you had a great stream. Anyone who's just coming in through Pamigan's Raid or otherwise, hi, my name's Wade, so nice to meet you. Uh, we play a variety of games around here. I do a lot of comfy, cozy stuff. Like today, we're starting up Garden Life. It just came out today. Um, otherwise, we've been playing some Nightingale recently, some um, Palea, my time at Sandrock. So we do a little bit of everything. Glad to have you in here. Hopping out of the Lagoon to Radio. Oh, a Lagoon sounds ultimate cozy. Thanks so much for coming over. It was a great stream. Good, Pambikin. Did some Sims and had a good time. I'm so glad you did. Your grandbabies just got home, so I had to wrap things up to tend to them. Completely understandable. If you need to, like, step away, um, take care of those grandbabies. I was about to say cran cranberries. <laughs> just go take care of your cranberries. <laughs> Please make sure to do so. But I'm really grateful for you bringing your community over here. Thanks for that. <laughs> Uh, 14th of March is when it's coming to Switch. Thanks for thanks for the information there. I appreciate you, Alexander. Oh man. Um, so here we are, about to jump into the game, and we have a couple options here. We have the story mode, which I think is probably what I'm gonna choose, but let's read through both of them. Immerse yourself in the story and world of Garden Life as you meet its cast of colorful characters. Recommended for new players. And then they also have a creative mode too. With everything at your disposal, you can let your creativity run wild. Warning, in this mode, you will not unlock any achievements. Oh, we can't have that. Let's, uh, let's do this one. Hi there. Okay, I'm gonna turn it down. We're happy to welcome you to our oh. community garden and hope that you'll settle in well. You know what's interesting? As you when I click heard, out of the game, the music stops time. being loud, but when I click back in, it amps up really loud. I'm not gonna lie, I can't hear her voice really at all because the music's so loud. She did mention um I think she did mention something about like like someone had had died someone had left them recently um but here we are great to finally meet you thanks a bunch for stepping up and volunteering okay really means a lot to us I think I can maybe bring the sound back a little bit for you guys over in OBS there we go so, um, Jasmine. Jasmine is the name of the, the main character. She is so stinking cute. And I do feel like I'm covering her up. So let's, uh, let's move on over to that side. There we go. Feel free to have a look around. The garden's not going anywhere. Don't mind if I do. Uh, hi, Anne-Marie. Welcome in. Solar, welcome in as well. I hope you're having a great day. Hooked on watching you because your voice is so soothing. Find new games is a great bonus. Solar, you're so sweet. Thanks so much for the kind words. All right, so um, we will just go on over here and walk across the street and enter the garden. Oh gosh, can you imagine having a garden like this? Oh, that'd be the dream. Oh, wow, beautiful. Hey, all right. As you can see, you've got your work. It has seen better you. days. I wanted to come by myself, but I've just been so busy. But now you're here, and you can look after the garden properly. And I reckon you're going to do great. Well, uh, no pressure. The best starting point is probably the weeds. You can rip them straight out of the ground. You should buy a sickle. Makes it much faster. Wait, this garden didn't have a sickle before? You mean I've got to buy one? All right, we out. 
<laughs> Bold of you to assume I have any money. A few weeds in the garden might keep pests away from your plants, but too many, and all they'll do is steal water. It's a fine balance. Always something to keep you on your toes. Okay, remove weeds from your garden. How's that um, sound sounding now, guys? I hope that it's okay. Remove weeds. So we have to hold E for it. Okay, all right. I guess we can just... Con oh, I was about to say I can continue holding them. <laughs> My pile is getting bigger and bigger. Hang on, do I... Can I put them... Oh, I can, I can, like exchange i can like uh use my scroll wheel to switch to a, a different spot okay all right i don't think it's getting bigger than this at least so that's good man this place is gonna be beautiful once we're done with it i'm so excited might need to um lower the mouse sensitivity a little bit because i'm feeling like it's a little high right now but not horrible not horrible We've even got a beautiful stream here in our garden. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, oh, it's gonna be beautiful. The artists did such a good job. They really, really did. Oh man, big kudos to the team. Looks gorgeous, doesn't it? No garden gnomes allowed? I don't know, there might be some garden gnomes. The compost bin is a great way to make weeds, leaf piles, and plant cuttings more useful. Oh. Leave them in here long enough and they'll turn into compost you can feed to your plants. Oh, that's so nice. We love recycling. That'll make the plants grow faster, which basically means a quick way to a prettier garden. Sign me up. So check out the compost bin by the shed. We still got some weeds to pick up, but I guess we can get the rest of those in a moment open compost bin okay so there's like uh, 12 spots here i was about to say 16 i can count um and how does this work do we like i'll do move stack and then do i like tran transfer stack no hang on give me a moment <laughs> I see previous, last, first. Or oh, are there multiple like pages of the compost? Well, that's interesting. Okay, so at first I was trying to like drag it over, but that doesn't seem to be working. Transfer stack. It kind of looks like it's showing like the right mouse button, like up here. That doesn't, oh. I was about to say that doesn't seem to be working for me. <laughs> Of okay. course, as I say it. Last bit of cleanup. <laughs> Here's a shovel to get rid of all the dead plants. Oh, thank you. It's a shame none of the plants made it, but their seeds should still be salvageable. Oh, good. Okay, all right. Um, so let's um maybe first we'll finish clearing up the weeds, and then we'll see about um, and then we'll see about digging up the the dead plants. I know I said uh, we'll see about digging up the big plants after that, but they will kind of do it on the way. <gasps> A new plant variant, yellow daffodil. Oh, I'm getting so excited, guys. Red rose. Okay, is this another red rose here? Probably so, since it didn't show something new. Purple wolf, how are you? I hope you're having a great day. Wait, what did? Anne Marie doing good? Good. So glad to hear it. Still healing from a fall I took down the stairs last week. I remember you saying that. Bless your heart. But things seem to be improving. Good. Good. I'm so glad to hear it. Still taking it easy though. Proud of you, friend. Which is easier with watching a cozy game like this one with our friend Wade. I'm so grateful to have you here for the adventure. Yeah, I've been really excited for this game. So I'm glad that we're getting to check it out together. So far it looks beautiful. Okay, um... I see you've okay. brought a rucksack with you, too. Smart. I don't think I ever saw Robin without theirs. They're great for just throwing anything and everything inside. Okay, she mentioned Robin. I wonder which one Robin is. Is Robin the dead one? I wonder. Mila, nice to see you. How are you? I hope you're well. Oh, when you said the uh, the inventory wasn't working? Yeah, no, like, I, I was, like, 
left clicking and right clicking. It just seemed to take like a few tries to get it to work for some reason, but we got it. We got it. We good. We Gucci. <laughs> I'm the, uh, the quality manager, Purple Wolf, Wolf, it's nice to meet you. We've had uh, so many like friendios from the, the dev team come in, so I appreciate you coming in too. But yeah, it's looking absolutely beautiful so far. So, keeping stock. Use uh, is that middle mouse button to change hotbot slots. Yeah, hot, oh, hot bar slots. <laughs> and then press tab to open your rucksack. Oh, nice. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Great work so far. I think there's enough room to start planting now. Seeds need a little bit of room to be able to grow properly. Some more than others. Otherwise, you can plant them anywhere. I've left Robin's plant book in the shed too. If you're ever unsure what a plant needs, you can probably find it there. What I think I'm gonna do is um, increase the volume just a little bit, but if it gets too loud for you guys, just let me know. Let's try maybe about like right there. Hopefully that won't be too loud. We'll see. Okay, so we have to plant five roses and five daffodils. Oh, and look at this shed. Oh my gosh. Can you imagine having like a shed like this? I would never leave my garden. I would live in here. I just put the bed right in here. It's okay. So we have a tool. Is that a clock? Oh, it was a clock. <laughs> Oh man. Hey, Jennifer, welcome into uh, such a great stream to uh, to watch at work while I'm neck deep in database maintenance. You're so precious. Thanks so much for being here. I hope that work is going well for you. So what do we have in the tool storage? Uh, nothing. Okay. All right. Well, at least we looked. Um, and then over here, we have our seed storage. Ooh. Okay. All right. Cool. For some reason, OBS is like glitching out right now. It like everything like went black for a second. Glad a stream is still up. <laughs> so I don't think we have anything in the seed storage yet. Um, a kitty? Hello! We can actually pet the kitty! Oh! <laughs> My heart! Hearts. Whoa, what was that? Just heard someone go, woohoo! <laughs> Um, we have a plant book here. Oh, wow. So this just kind of like tells you like tutorial stuff and like different information about different plants. Oh, wow. I'm sure we're going to have to look through this 37 pages to it. Goodness gracious. Um, I love the huge teacup too. Man, imagine drinking a cozy drink out of that. And um, this must be the, the character who passed and, and maybe this was their garden. Possibly, possibly so. Uh, so to do, place a bench, set up a garden stall, sort out garden hose, have the bridge rebuilt, have to uh, have the rubble cleared away, open up the greenhouse, complete the plant book, help Jasmine with the pavilion. So just a, just a couple things, just a couple things. No pressure, no pressure. <laughs> Not ready to use this yet. And then we do have decor storage. Beautiful, beautiful. It's getting late. Take the bus to wrap up for today. No, um, you're mistaken. I live here now. We're sleeping in this garden. Is that gonna be a problem? I did kind of want to um to do like do some planting before we left. Can we do that? How do we do that? It does say plant. I see where we can like place the tool, but no, that's not what I need to do. Maybe I don't need to like dig a spot. Maybe I just need to, yes. Okay, all right. So, oh, where are we gonna plant them? Do we do like kind of like in a row somewhere or do I do them kind of random? Oh, the freedom. I don't know if I should be given this much power. Maybe we'll do them kind of like along the side here kind of like alternate them possibly. All right, we'll do you. Um, for some reason I can't, I can't, um, I didn't mean to plant that there. Or wait a minute. Oh, I didn't plant the first one. <laughs> I was so confused. I thought I already put it in place. 
what I'm struggling with now is like how to um, switch back to like um, other stuff, like the roses, because I wanted to alternate. But right now it's just like rotating this. Maybe if I hit escape, that's what it is. Okay. Oh, the roses are a lot bigger. All right. Well, we'll put you there. All right. I'm learning. I'm learning, friends. And then we'll put you there. Then escape and do that. Am I going to have time before they force me to get on the bus? We'll find out and see. Maybe I could just try to leave enough room for this one. So I can go ahead and like plant the rest of them. That'd be enough. One, two. I think there's going to be another one on this side. Okay, so we'll do that. And that. Interesting, now it's not highlighting like the blue. Oh, but that, that one did. <laughs> so <random>. Amazing. <laughs> so here is your watering can. It's a little small, but it'll work for now. Oh, it's perfect. Every seed you plant will need some water to get it going. Then need watering regularly. Is that Maccas that I see over in the YouTube chat? Hey, Maccas, nice to see you. Hope that you're uh, feeling okay today, and I hope that your um, appointment with the doctor later goes well. You can pet a cat game of the year, 100%. <laughs> I'm going to duck out now. All trains are arriving soon. Want to save my battery? Understandable, Jacob. Please be safe on your travels, friend. We'll see you later. Ashara, welcome in. Thanks for the work, Lurk. I hope work's going great. Underwatered plants will be brown, crispy, and they'll droop a bit too. And the ground around them will be discolored. Okay, uh, to use the watering can on unwatered plants. What what time is it right now in game? Did we did we literally like just like stay up through the entire night? I wonder. I do hear crickets, so I think it is still nighttime. I think so. I think so. <laughs> okay. All right. Water, water, water. Are you watered? It looks darker. So yeah, I think we did water it. Oh, this is so satisfying. Okay. All right. Good. Use the watering can on unwatered plants. All right. What? Maybe they need more water, do you think? Will it give me like a notification when it's fully watered? I think we're out of water now. You can fill up here, right? Refill watering can, oh, so satisfying. Okay, Um. well, I felt like I watered all of them, but maybe, maybe that one wasn't watered. No, something still isn't happy. <laughs> which which one do you think, friends? <laughs> Sam, thanks for the hydration. I made a smoothie before stream, so I've just been sipping on the last bit of that. <clears throat> Deciding between the organized garden or a giant uh, mess of flowers is going to be hard, right? But like, I guess if, you know, this grows and I'm not happy with it, we can always change it. We can always change it. Am, am, I, am I doing something wrong? You need to go home to complete the mission. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thank you, Purple Wolf. Yeah, I was like, I was expecting that the quest was going to complete since it didn't like mention anything about like going home there. But I, I do acknowledge that it has been telling me to go home for a while and I've completely been ignoring that because <laughs> I thought I still had stuff to do here still. <laughs> All right, let's go home for the day. Look at little grandma back there. Amazing. My first achievement, look complete day this. one. Look at how great the garden looks already. Oh, is it growing? You're natural. Oh, shucks. I think that's enough for one day. There's no rush with any of this. You should have time to explore anyway. Shelly Smalls, nice to see you. How have you been doing? I hope you're well. Just keep an eye on the time. Make sure to get some rest at the end of the day. Okay, all right. So when it tells you to go rest, actually go rest. Got it. <laughs> Um, and then we need to press T to check the time. Oh, 
Oh, okay. Um, it's actually behind my um behind my camera right now, so you can't Remember, see it, but it's there. Gardening, patience is key. Bezos bucks. Sometimes all service. you can do is wait as your plants grow and flourish. If you want, just take the bus home. Tony, thank you so much for the five month resub. Guys, can we get some hype in, ch in the Twitch chat for uh, our friend Tony? Thank you, thank you so much for the support. I hope you're having a nice day. Second new game this week? Am I on the right channel? We, uh, it's just been a, a crazy week of new games coming out and like all games that I've been like really excited to play. So, so yeah, yeah, this is Garden Life. We just started it up and uh, I'm enjoying it so far. It's beautiful. I won't be able to meet you tomorrow, but I'll write you a postcard. Check the post box when you get here in the morning. See ya. Oh, okay. All right. Wait. So now our quest is to go home for the day. Didn't we just go home? Maybe, maybe like I, maybe I completed some stuff yesterday that like I wasn't supposed to, maybe I was supposed to save the watering for today. No active quest to deliver, huh? Oh, well, we do have some stuff to do here regardless, but maybe it's just not part of our quest that we do that. But I was, I was definitely confused when I first got here and it's like, okay, go home. Oh my gosh, our plants grew so fast. Look at them. Look at all of our beautiful flowers. Definitely not the most beautiful setup. Um, the spacing is very off, but <laughs> we can we can fix that. We can fix that. <laughs> and friends, thanks for dropping all that hype in chat too. Um, <clears throat> How goes the game, Arabella? Nice to see you. It's on your wish list. So we just started it up and it's been really beautiful so far. Really beautiful. Your plant is happy. Well, that's good. I probably need to give it some more water though, right? Oh, so that that was like a very clear indication that it was watered. We did get something that time. Well, that's good. That's good. Okay. Is everything... Nope. I was about to say, is everything watered now? Nope. We need some more water. Okay. Let's go and grab this. Sloth, nice to see you too. I hope that you're well. I think it's because you completed a mission out of sync when it was end of day. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah, I was like worried I would like just hadn't completed stuff fast enough. So I was like, okay, well, let me finish up what I can do today and then we'll go home. But it actually seemed like it did want me to go home. <laughs> All right. Okay. So um, now, now that everything is watered here, I guess I, I guess we can go home again i don't i don't think there's anything else i can do at the moment well maybe i can i can pick up some rocks i didn't do that last time so yeah let's um let's do some cleanup here did it say we could do anything with the rocks honestly i might end up like replacing some of these rocks some of them are actually like really cute Don't think we can get rid of those. Yeah, I don't. I don't think I can put any any stuff in the com or any rocks in the compost bin. But we can put some more of this. Okay, that was a lot more seamless about me putting it in that time. Um, and then we got some quick growth fertilizer. Did we own? Oh, I was about to say, did we only get one from all that compost that we put in yesterday? But I guess depending on how much we put in. This, like, vial here is, like, a certain amount of full, I guess you could say. So, do we think I should put... Well, I was about to say, should I put that on my flowers? They seem like they grew pretty quickly without it. <laughs> well, there is some more stuff that we need to clean up here. Completely missed that. Man, I can't wait until we can, like, just build this bridge here. You're telling me I can't jump this gap? Ooh, that was a really big stone there. Okay, all right. Um, a little bit more here. A little bit, a little bit. And um, thank you. 
I think that's part of the music, I think. The woo! <laughs> cracks me up every time. <laughs> All right, we'll put some more compost in, then, then we'll go home for the day, I think. Okay, so let's put you in. There we go. And, um... I think that's I think that's all that we can do for today. I want to say. All right, so I'm going home. I'm doing a thing. Are you proud of me? <laughs> I'm uh, writing some notes uh, to send to the rest of the team. Oh, you're so precious, Lothari. Well, the idea that uh, you're just uh, chucking small boulders into your tiny rucksack, video game logic truly is amazing. Man, imagine if we had like a never ending pouch like that IRL. Shiny. What is this an ad for? For that poreless android look you'll never achieve in real life. <laughs> I, I need, I need shiny. <laughs> That's great. Um, all right, we're going home for the day. What a date, what a way to wrap up the day. All right, so here we are back and um, we now need to accept Jasmine's request from the mailbox. When I hear the name Jasmine. There's a village square too. Okay, okay, it's not telling me to do that right now. I'm trying to stay focused. When I hear the name Jasmine, it just makes me think of Jasmine from my time at Sandrock. Check your mail. Woo! <laughs> Good morning. Sorry I can't be there today. I've got to catch up with some wedding planning. Oh! I'm making a gift for my fiance, Marcus. Dang it, she's not single. You'll meet him soon, don't worry. I need some daffodils for it. You'll need a pair of uh, pruning shears to cut them. When you cut the daffodils, leave them in the drop box outside the garden by the fence, and I'll pick them up tomorrow morning. Drop box outside, okay. All right, have a great day, and thanks, Jazz. Deliver eight yellow daffodil cuttings. Reward 80 florins, so I'm assuming that's the currency in this game. Dokies, all right. Oh, hello there, dearie. Oh, Grandma! You must be the new gardener. I'm Leslie. I run the gardening shop in the village square. I love Leslie already. Oh, but I see you got Jasmine's postcard. That's something Robin suggested, sending postcards to make requests. <sighs> they always wanted the garden to help us all out, bless them. It's secateurs you need, but I've got them in the shop, so you should pop by. I always have a few tools you can have. What did she call them? She didn't call them pruning shears. I, I couldn't tell what she called them. Then just snip away at a plant's flower to get flower cuttings. Or prune the stems to get stem cuttings for compost. And, and don't worry, the flowers can always grow back. Okay, all right. Get pruning shears from Leslie's shop in the village square. Awesome. Hang on, let me click over here again. I'm having like some issues with OBS today. I've never had before. I had like an update and I think it was like a bad update to it. Okay, we'll uh, grab some more weeds out of here before we do any pruning. And um, then we'll go to the, uh, the village square. I'm so excited to see what that's gonna look like. Probably need to water our plants again too. Maybe we can do that before we go. Okay, I'll throw this in the compost bin. All right, so you can go in here. We have some more of this. Okie dokes. And uh, am I all full now in my uh, tool belt? I think I am. Can I put like the rocks away or something? I can. All right, we'll throw those in there. Free up our space a little bit. And let's do some watering now. We also got to uh, pet the kitty today. I haven't pet the kitty. I don't think I pet the kitty yesterday. Gosh, what am I doing with my life? Garden life's just like flying by me already. We get everything. I hope so. Maybe not that one? Can't tell really. Florence, so we're in Italy? Oh my gosh, even better. Italy is like top of my bucket list. 
one day, one day. I guess apparently this day. <laughs> okay, so, um, we are going to the village square. This is the village. Isn't it lovely? That's my shop there, Leslie's. You'll find all sorts of useful things for the garden there. Oh! And Robin and Jasmine's little pavilion project is through that archway to the right. But that's closed for now. Such a shame. What happened? What happened? Anyway, take a look around. I'll make sure to make the secateurs available for you. She calls them like secateurs or something? I don't think I've ever heard that word. So we need to get the pruning shears from Leslie's shop here in the village square. Oh boy. Oh boy. You know how I said I was never leaving the garden? <laughs> About that. If it's here, I'll make an exception. Oh, wow. Adriana, nice to see you. I hope you're great. Hannah, it makes you think of uh, Bessie Jasmine and cry because I miss you Questions. I hope that she can join us for some games soon. That would be good. Does the bus advance the day? Yeah, taking the bus home, it does seem to like switch to the next day. Mm -mm. Woo, let's get this garden party started. <laughs> I love the voices. I do wonder who uh, did the voice acting for this game. Hey, so we can't go in this door. I'm, I'm by the way, going to try to go in every door. This place is so beautiful. This is to go back to our garden. And, um, she mentioned an archway, like, leading to, like, somewhere that, um, that was, like, closed off. Is it this? Was this formerly their shop? It won't even let me go past the archway, so I bet you, I bet you that's it. Maybe it'll be open at some other point in the game, possibly. Possibly so. All right, into Leslie's Garden Shop. Spring items, Leslie's Garden Store. I, I believe in you. I believe in you, chat. <laughs> let them grow. Beautiful, beautiful. Is that a huge... Oh, I thought it was like a plushie. I think that's a real frog on the counter. Uh, uh hello? Oh, sorry about the mess, come on in. Oh my gosh, so she sells like decor for your garden. Look at these beautiful archways and the bench. And we have like some trellises too and the fences. Oh, hang on. What else do we have? A big old frog. Um, we have a froggy lantern. A beautiful gazebo. We have some Halloween decor. Okay. Oh, look at this ladder. Oh, guys, I want all the things. Hey, there are some gnomes in here. A lidded planter. Planter table, cauldron planter, some some snails, <laughs> some more rocks, some mushrooms. Oh, ooh, those wind chimes look really pretty. Oh my gosh, guys, I want all of this stuff. Well, I have I have fifty. I have fifty right now. The little lambs. <laughs> Wait a minute, are there different categories too? Oh my gosh, she has more stock. So these are, I guess, like the tools. And then here you can buy seeds from her too. Okay, all right. So long. What did I need to do again? Uh, pruning shears, that's what we need to get. Oh, lovely to see you again, I was just, I was just so see in the zone. See you next time, dearie. Oh, wow. Oh, don't mind Letha. She's in no mood today. Mm. I uh, actually learn what uh, mushroom is in Korean today. Coincidence? I think not. <laughs> okay, so we need pruning shears. Which are these? Which are these? Oh, and look, they're free! 
There's also a watering can here too. I wonder if it's better than my current watering can. I don't think so. I think it looks like it. And we also have a shovel. And I don't have pest removal spray that I know of. All right, just focusing on this for now. Okay, so we have the pruning shears. Should I go ahead and get some pest removal spray since it's free? And we don't have it, I don't think? Okay, all right, we have pest removal spray too. <laughs> Should I get more? <laughs> Do you think it'll be free forever? Thank you. Come again. All right. Thanks, Leslie. You have a beautiful shop, ma'am. Oh, man. Sadly, I can't go past here. But goodness, look at all of this. This is a huge cash register, too. But man, it's beautiful. Oh, and looky here. Are these the developers here? And their pets, maybe? Oh, this is super cool. <laughs> oh, and this is um, the person that I think that, that died? That we haven't really learned a whole lot about yet? Interesting that there's a photo of them here. Hmm. Okay. All right. Let's go back to the garden and we will um, get some daffodil cuttings. Do you think I was holding the pruning shears the entire time while I was, <laughs> while I was riding my bicycle? <laughs> it is the dev team. Oh, I really like that homage purple wolf. That's super cool. Okay, so trim plants. Oh, did that work? Oh, this is not, this is not a, a daffodil. That, that's why it didn't affect my quest. <laughs> But if we if we need any rose trimmings, we got them now. Um, what does that do exactly? Hang on. So yeah, we just have some some rose cuttings. I wonder how much you can like cut, get cuttings of stuff before like it like kills the plant. Oh no! I just did one cutting of the daffodil and it like completely like ate it up. Oh, oh no. Or wait a minute. Maybe it's because I, I accidentally did um, two on it? Maybe, maybe. Did I do one on this one? You can actually see the flowers disappearing. That's interesting. So maybe I didn't on this one then. Oh, 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 guys. Oh, wow. Um, is stream okay? I think there was like a memory leak or something in the game just now because like it just like like completely like froze up and obs let me know that it got uh overloaded well that was interesting <laughs> mm -mm. also uh maria welcome in how's it going only just joined, but this game seems so nice. It's super, super beautiful so far, and I'm excited to learn more about the lore and stuff with it. Kim was stuck too for a second, but you're back now. Thanks for the heads up, Hannah. Yeah, that was a uh, that was concerning for a moment. <laughs> and um, Kevin, thank you for the stream stream three stream streak. Ooh, that's a mouthful. How you doing? I hope you're having a great day. Get some more. It doesn't seem like I'm getting any cuttings from this daffodil. I think I might have gotten it too close to the to the rose. I don't know. I'm not. I'm not getting any plant cuttings right now. I'm just. It's like just showing leaves. Oh well, we did did just get a, a rose. I think I did get a daffodil there. Cool, cool. And can we get one from like maybe in here? Have to get rid of some of these leaves. Okay, all right. So it actually does show you where it's like trimming it. That's that's actually really nice. I was not ex expecting it was going to be like that specific. I love that. I thought it was just going to take from a random spot, but no, but no. No wonder I wasn't getting flowers. Still trying to get you. There we go. Okay, so oh, I think we have eight now. You'll be a champion pruner in no time. You should put them in that red box by the fence. That's Robin's drop box. 
If someone sends you a postcard, you can always put what they've requested in there in exchange for the gift they've left you. All part of Robin's plan to make this a place for the community. That's gonna be wonderful. Ah, you have to use the little indicator to line up the uh, right stem. Right, right. Like I wasn't expecting it to be that specific. So the fact that like you guys put that much uh, thought into it, it's um, really cool. Really unexpected. But very appreciated. Very appreciated. Okay, so is is this the drop box? Hello, daffodil cuttings. Hold to deliver. Did I do the thing? It does seem like they're still in my inventory. Maybe Your I got extra. Your is truly Ooh. complete without beautiful decorations. And while you were away, I found a little something to kickstart your collection. Place them wherever you like, dearie. They'll instantly spruce the place up. And if you're looking for more, we've always got a big collection in the shop. Is Grandma giving us some some decor? I love her already. Oh, the pictures are of all the devs. Yes, that's super cool. Okay, so um, hold then released right click to enter object placement mode. Maybe I need to have like an empty hand. Um, I'm gonna put away. Let's put some compost over in here, I guess. Oh, we can also put the flowers in there. Oh, they're so beautiful, though. I don't think I want to do that. Hold, then release. Right click to enter object placement mode. Maybe I need to, like, do it over a critter? Oh, I think I need to have it in my hot bar, in my toolbar. Okay. So now if I hold right click, hold then release. Maybe I need to go in like a different mode for it, possibly. Not sure. <laughs> How many hours in this game? I'm not sure how long the game is supposed to be, but um, we've only been playing it for maybe like half an hour now. So not far in at all. Open release. Use E to rotate an object. Place down. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. I don't think I entered object placement mode, but... Oh. So will this move it? Press E to rotate an object clockwise. Sounds. <laughs> okay, and then press to place frogs. So I'm assuming this will move it then. Maybe we'll have you right over here near the pond. Does that move it? No, it just placed another. <laughs> this was such fun. It was nice to be out of the shop for a bit. You come by any time, Granny. Oh, but it was lovely to meet you, dearie. You've done some excellent work so far. Aww. Robin would be very proud of that, I've no doubt. She's so cute. Thanks for bringing me some some frogs, Grandma. Um, so yeah, I think she gave us two. So where do I want the other one? We want it like to be hanging out with the, this one, hanging out with its friend. I like the tongue sticking out <laughs> or um do i want it somewhere else hmm maybe on the other side of the of the um there we go that, that time it went into the object placement mode um and it looks like i can rotate with um middle mouse wheel as well I'm gonna just plop you right there. Okay, so we have our two froggy friends. So cute, so cute. <laughs> okay, um, it's telling me it's getting late. Take the bus to wrap up the day. Oh, but before we do, before we do. Gotta pet the kitty. Oh, the little meow, it's so precious. Twix, how are you? I hope that you're having a great day. Welcome in.
And hey, Shadow Dragon, nice to see you. New game, who this? Uh, yeah, we started this up today. Day. I'm Laurie, Robin's sister. Jasmine told me you started a couple of days ago and said I should drop by. You've done an amazing job so far. Is Robin the one that passed away? I think they are. She's so cute. It's a bit strange seeing someone else working here than them, but I'll get used to it. Mm. <laughs> That's the point. Anyway, I was wondering. Something Robin was looking into was adding some climbing plants. Would you, please? Some climbing plants? Don't mind if I do. Like some ivy? Here's something for you to practice with. Oh, she gave us like a trellis too. Oh, guys, the rain is so cozy. Is it too loud or anything? If so, just let me know. We also have some mail here as well. Hi there. The flower store has been asked to make up a birthday bouquet for someone in the village. You think you could be able to spare some daffodils, tulips, and roses? Ooh, I don't have any any um, tulips planted, I don't think. Thank you, Jasmine. Okay, all right. We might need to go to the um, to the village again to buy some tulip seeds, possibly, possibly so. All right, let's uh, gather up some more weeds here. Take care of the garden. Oh, lovely! Oh. I've just spotted some seeds that are ready to pick. Oh, no need for a tool. You can do that by hand. Hmm. Could they possibly be tulip seeds? Finding seeds can be a little tricky sometimes, so keep an eye out for those plants that are positively glowing. Oh. Sometimes the plants glow with a different color. That means you've got a new colored seed. Try to collect them all. Oh, don't mind if I do. Harvest a seed. Okay, so she said look for like the glowing plants. Yeah, okay, all right, we'll get over there in just a moment. Let me just finish doing some cleanups first. I think we got all of them. Most of them are glowing, honestly. Okay, all right. We do need to do some pruning here too. Like these ones here are looking like a little bit um much. I I just love that you can like individually choose like where you're pruning as well. Like again, was not expecting that at all. The thought that's going into it is like just fantastic. I feel like I'm actually a gardener. Oh boy. Oh boy. All right, harvest seeds. Oh, so was it like rose rose seeds that we got, I'm assuming? It was rose seeds. Okay, so we'll, we'll probably have to go to the village and get some tulip seeds, but we can do that. We can do that. We'll get some um, seeds there too, some seeds from you. We definitely need to do some pruning here. I could maybe, like, sell, um, these, like, extra roses that I'm getting, too. Man, we have a lot here. I do like the audio design for this game. But I'll say for, like, the sound effects, like, specifically. Like, especially when you're doing, like, a lot of, like, pruning. Hearing that didinch, 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 like, every time is getting, a, like, a little bit much. Again, other than that, the audio design is really beautiful. I'm liking the music. Some more seeds there. Yeah, this uh, this rose bush here is like really overflowing. Let's see if we can uh, get some of these overhanging ones out of the way a little bit. It's already looking a little bit better. Um, and can we get some seeds from you? We can. I didn't miss any from here, did I? I don't think so. Hopefully not. Hi, Mr. J-Star. How are you? I hope you're having a great day. Megan, welcome in too. And hey, Breezy, welcome in as well. How's uh, Thursday treat you guys? I hope it's been really good. And are you going to lurk? Appreciate the lurks. Thanks so much. I hope that your meeting goes well. 
uh, to take Puppy for a walk. Um, enjoy the game. Thank you for streaming. No worries at all, Purple Wolf. Thanks so much for being here. I really appreciate it. Say hi to your doggo for us, please. You guys enjoy your walk together. Can I get the seats from this one? Maybe I need to like trim it first. Let's do that. We're probably getting like a lot of roses here. I wonder how much they'll sell for. I think we do need to keep some for that bouquet, but it's okay. Try to get some of these um little, little stuffs there. There we go. That's a little bit better. Maybe we'll get like that bottom one there. Maybe these like side ones. Okay, and some seeds. And some seeds. Okay, all right. So, how are we looking now? We have 43 <laughs> red rose cuttings. <laughs> and we have four daffodil seeds and five rose seeds. Did I miss one of the daffodils? Two, three. No, I don't, I don't think I see anything sparkling. I don't think so. Okay, so yeah, I'm gonna assume that we got them all then. So, um, what I, oh, we still need to place the trellis somewhere. Where do I want to place it is the question. Oh, I bought some ivy seeds too. And there might be some still in the shed, I suppose. Robin said climbers can be a bit tricky. You have to plant them very close to an object for them to take. I'm sure you'll get there. You seem to have done everything else very well up to this point. Oh shucks. I was trying to um like place this in a way that I wanted, but I can't. I can't. Oh, I was about to say I can't get it to go into the um the um object placement mode. I think I just wasn't like like releasing the hold like quick enough still gotta mess around with that a little bit okay so where do i want my trellis exactly um maybe like over here in this corner i'm gonna place it right there Okay, all right, so we have a trellis. Woohoo! <laughs> Maybe you can turn off the uh, sound effects in the settings. If it gets to be where it's too much, I will, but there are some like really beautiful sound effects too, and it's like I don't want to turn those off completely, you know? Does this game have, uh, have combat as well? Oh, it better not. <laughs> I would be shocked if it did. <laughs> Ooh. Um, so are you planting a garden for yourself or for others? Um, so from the sound of it, this will be like a community garden, but, um, we're able to like take the profits from the garden and like use them to, to better improve it. So yeah, yeah, it's been a uh, very, very interesting so far. Very beautiful. Okay. So we need to get the ivy seeds from the shed. You know what's interesting is um we looked in in here in the seed storage the other day and there were no seeds in here do you think do you think the ghosts left them in here for us mm -hmm. interesting all right we have ivy seeds now i only need to plant one but we do have three do you think i should do them like side by side or Maybe we'll just do like the one for now and we'll save the other two. See how much this one like grows on the on the trellis, I guess. Okay, uh oh. There we go. Okay, alright, so yeah, we'll let that do its thing. I and... really appreciate you doing this. The ivy, specifically, but everything else too. Please, take this. Robin wanted to do so much with this garden. I'm glad someone else gets to now. I might not quite be there yet, but I really hope that seeing it all come together will help me. Sorry. Anyway, I'm going to head off. I hope you have a good day here. Plenty to do, after all. Oh, it's
it's getting late. Take the bus to wrap up for the day, but I haven't even bought some some tulip seeds. I still need to. So I'm gonna put some stuff in here as well. We'll um, put you in there, and well, maybe I could use some like, quick growth fertilizer on the the ivy that we that we planted. Oh. Yeah, let's, let's do that. that. Is that good? Did we do it? I probably didn't need to use that much on it, but I wasn't sure if it was going to give me a notification once it was fully fertilized. But I guess you just have to wait to see if the, the blue stuff pops up, the blue little spots. All right, riding my bike in the rain. <laughs> Are you still here, dearie? You know, you really shouldn't work so hard. Granny, once you get to know me, you'll find now I need to get as much done in a day as I can. It's time for me to close up shop for the day. You should think about going home, too. We'll all still be here tomorrow. Grandma, no! I need, I need tulips! The shop is closed. No! Okay. Uh, oh. hello? Oh, hi. Well, you can hear me. That's good. Don't worry, I'm friendly. <laughs> I hope that's reassuring. Uh, is, are, are you a ghost? I'm Robin. I didn't say anything before because, well, I thought it might be a bit overwhelming. And the others don't know I'm still here. I'm not really sure how they'd take it. But I wanted to tell you. This garden already looks great. I'm really impressed. And very grateful. If you don't mind, could you go into the shed, please, when you've got a moment? Okay, uh, check out the to-do list in the in the shed. We, oh, we did see that before. Well, we need to go back to the shed anyway. Oh, Penguin, nice to see you. I have to work in work today, but just wanted to stop by and say hello. I hope everyone is having a great day. That's so sweet of you, Penguin. Thanks so much for the seven month resub. Guys, we get some hype in chat for our friend Penguin over there, uh, over there on Twitch doing that resub. Penguin, that really, really helps toward my February paid sub goal, uh, getting me one step closer to the plus program. So thanks for that. How are you doing? I hope you're well. I uh, hope that works treating you well too. Also, it was good to see you over in uh, Nick's stream yesterday. Yeah, the glasses on, on Gran are great. I love Grandma. She's so cute. <laughs> Technically, her name's Leslie, but I think I'm always going to call her Grandma. <laughs> Cozy Ghost Gardening Game. Like, I don't know, you know, like, what else would you have expected? Of course there's a ghost. Of course. Of course. Is that the kitty? Hi, kitty. Okay, so here's See, the two the list. between the two tables. I do. Underneath the clock. That's mine. When I finally got this garden, I wanted it to be somewhere for the entire community. There are some great people here who deserve somewhere to reflect and relax for a while. And, obviously, I never managed to do it all. They say how she, or how they passed? Now, I don't want to put you under any pressure. This is your garden now. But I would really appreciate it if you could finish the list for me. But that's enough nagging from me today. <laughs> we'll pick this up again when you're back in tomorrow. Oh, okay. All right. Well, um, no surprise. We do need to do the to-do list. But I just got an achievement that we um, that we have completed the tutorial apparently. So that's that's exciting. All right. Let's. Uh, As you can see, oh. the weather's finally turned. Yes, I can see. Gardening across different kinds of weather can be a little bit tricky. Plants react to different weathers differently. Rain is good. That means you don't need to water your plants. Woohoo! Farming Simmer's best friend. It's all in the book I kept. If you want to check it out. Sounds good. I would totally live in that shed. Like once we first got here, I was like, I'm never leaving here. <laughs> But I guess since it's it's a, a rainy, cozy evening, and to progress, and to go to Leslie's shop tomorrow, let's uh, go home and get some sleeves. Look, Leslie's right there. We could just buy some seeds from her right now. 
totally. I was thinking, if anyone knows anyone who can build you a stall, it's probably Leslie. Speaking of which... The bench I wanted to put in was for her as much as for anyone else. She always works so hard and likes to come by in the evenings. It would be nice for her to have somewhere to sit. Oh, agreed. Maybe if you do that for her, she'll ask one of her customers to build a garden stall for you. Ooh. Or there's a crafting table on the right in the shed. With some creativity, I'm sure you can find a way to build a bench from scratch. Oh. <laughs> I was like, yeah, let's just buy one. It can't be that hard, can it? Uh, no, totally not. Okay, well, um, I was just about to go to Leslie's to, to buy some tulip seeds. However, we now need to, to craft a squirrel bench, apparently. I don't know what goes into the crafting in this game, so what I'll do is I'll go check that out, make sure we don't need to purchase any, um, stuff. Since we're going to town soon. Hello, there's a street party coming up that we've been asked to put together some bouquets for. Since it's local, we thought it might be a nice idea for some of the flowers to come from the garden. Do you think you'd be able to supply some roses and sunflowers for us? Okay, now we need sunflowers too. <laughs> Thank you, Leslie. Okay, so tulips and, um, tulips and, and, um, sunflowers. Yeah. Okay. Let's check out that crafting bench first, though. Gather up some weeds, too. Hi, kitty. And, um, craft items. So, oh, you can actually make bouquets here? That's interesting. But we can also, we can craft some decor here. Wrapping paper, basic pond, flower ladder, frog pond, a snowman, garland, magic frog, some stones, taking it all in. Squirrel bench. This is what we need to make. So it needs, it needs rocks. Um, and we actually harvested up a bunch of rocks the other day. So what if I take them right now? Would that be enough to make the bench? I wonder. Did I pass by it? Oh, I think it moves everything that you can craft onto the front page. All right, squirrel bench. Do, 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 do. Nice, nice. Let's um put our other stones away for now, just to free up some space. So, so if I put our handy dandy squirrel bench right there, I like how we're just like holding a like a itty bitty little bench. <laughs> She looks a little bit bigger now. Where do we want to put it? Oh, oh guys, where do you think we should put our our bench? Should we have it like by the water? Maybe, possibly? Let's put it in the logs. I'm sure Granny won't mind like just climbing up to the bench, right? Surely not, no. <laughs> I think I'm going to put it right there. I want to make sure she wasn't falling it's off. It's not that hard. Well done. The squirrels are a particularly excellent touch. Thank you. You should go and find Leslie in the village and tell her. She'll love it. And don't forget to mention the stall. Sounds good. We were just about to go to Leslie anyway, so that actually works out perfectly. We need to buy some tulip and sunflower seeds from her. Oh, hello, dearie. I hope you're having a pleasant day. I am. Thank you so much for putting a bench in the garden. I can't wait to sit and watch the world go by. Hmm? Oh, don't you worry about how I know. Word travels quickly around here. Now, I should do something to thank you. You want to put up a stall to sell things from the garden? Mm -hmm. I think I can arrange that. One of my customers is a carpenter. Tell you what, he came in recently asking for some bouquets for his sister's birthday. 
Uh, now the garden is up and running again. Perhaps you could make them for him. Oh, we did see where we can make some bouquets. A favor for a favor is a much nicer exchange than money, don't you think? Here is a list of what he asked me for. Set them in the drop box and I'll pass them on to him and make sure the favor is returned. Here's a few seeds to get you started. Oh. You can always grab more from my shop if you'd like. That was the plan. What did she give us? Oh, we did get some sunflower seeds. Nice. How many did she give us? Um, let's daffodil. She gave us two sunflowers. Um, I'm trying to remember how many did we need for... Oh, and we also got uh, red poppy seeds, I suppose. How many did we need for that um that quest? I love the music, it's so good. Um, so for the quest we need five sunflower cuttings. Um, I mean, and with each plant you can well, I was about to say with each plant you can usually do multiple cuttings. With the sunflowers, they might be different. So I'm going to Get a few more, just to just to be on the safe oh, side. Don't mind the clutter. Come on I think. In. I think so. Okay. Um. Maybe I should do even more since we have this. So long. This bouquet that we need to do. See you next time, dearie. Oh. oh come um, on in. Don't be shy. We'll do. Is it, will it just buy one? I think it just bought one. Yeah. I'm gonna have five of those. And then, how many tulips do we need? Are, are things happening? What in the world? Iona, it's so nice to see you, beautiful. Welcome, welcome in. Holy moly. Um, Mermaid, welcome in. Allie, welcome in too. Mouse, hello. Slick Jim. Playable Dead, Chisbits, Cam. Um, bookish. Uh, Tommy Earth, did I say it right? Ooh. What is happening right now? Magridi, thank you so much for the 14 month resub. Oh goodness. Um, Pink, um, Pool Lass. Welcome, welcome in, everybody. I know I'm missing some names. Disguised, uh, Kill Dreams, uh, Emily, Swimfin, Bumble. Welcome, welcome in. Sunshine, welcome in too. Anybody who's new here, hi, my name's Wade. So nice to meet you. We play a variety of games around here, but especially a lot of comfy, cozy games, as I know our fellow friend Iona over there does too. Iona, how was your stream? What were you up to? I hope it was a really, really great stream for you today. So glad to see you, and thanks so much for bringing your community over. Also, did we get a, uh, a shout out in the chat for uh, Miss Iona? Hang on, just in case we didn't, let me uh, do a thing. My chat's been like glitching out a little bit today because I had like an OBS update that was like wonky. But thank you. Thanks so much for coming over here. You're so, so precious to me. Anybody, um, if by some small chance you're not following Yona, I'm sure that you are because she's absolutely wonderful. She plays all the comfiest of cozy games. Um, Please, please make sure to go send her some love. She's got such a, a beautiful like, spirit. She's a beautiful being inside and out. Um, and uh, I'm curious what she was playing today. Anybody who just came over, tell me what was your favorite thing about her Strim Shram? Also, Adriana, thanks for the hydration. I appreciate you. And um, did I see a uh, treat redeem for, for Finn too? I think I might have. I'm having this like weird thing right now in game when I like uh, click into it, my um, like it's like my OBS is like freezing. It's just like a lot of like really weird things going on. We played five games today. Oh my gosh. <laughs> she she might have been a little bit busy. Which uh which was the favorite of the uh, of the games? I'm curious to hear. Oh man. I think I may have seen a uh, treat redeem for Finn right before you guys came in too. Was it from Bob? Bob, if so, thanks so much for your patience. I really appreciate you. Let me go over to this screen for a moment. And uh, we'll, we'll see a uh, precious little man over there. Is he sleeping? Where are you, buddy? Um, I was just wondering. Would you, um, would you like a little treat, my son? Your 
friend Bob decided they wanted to redeem one for you. Would you like this? Hey. Thank you for my treats. Also, uh, Pokey welcome man. I hope you're having a nice day too. Ooh, so the games today that Yona was playing are Palea, Love Palea, um, Vandal Tale, Garden Life, and uh and Marbles. Oh my gosh. <laughs> what did you guys think of uh, Garden Life? Because as you can obviously see, that's what we're doing today. Well the other one was Penny News. Okay, I don't think I've heard about that one. Interesting, interesting. Wait a minute, hang on. Was that one of the ones that showed up in the Nintendo um, Direct yesterday? That might have been the case. Possibly so, possibly so. He's adorable, thanks guys. Jim, nice to see you. Swim fin, welcome into. All right, let me go back on over to this screen here and uh, we'll, we'll get back into the game arena. I'm so glad that you guys are all here. Thanks so much for coming over in that raid. So yeah, we're still very early in this game, but I was just here at Grandma's shop, and we were buying some uh, some seeds for uh, for our garden. So yeah, good stuff. Good stuff. <laughs> I gotta figure out. I might have to reload the game honestly though, because I'm I'm noticing some some weird issues going on with uh with OBS right now. Where like literally any time that I like look over to the game. It's um just not loading chat, like chat freezes. I don't think like refreshing it'll help. We'll try this. And um if not I'll reload game and see if that'll help. Mm. Penny's Big Breakaway was the name of the game. Uh was sponsored today. Awesome, awesome. Yeah, I've like never heard of it. I'll have to uh I'll have to check them out. But Eun is a wonderful bean, and, and she deserves all the recognition. So they uh, they definitely chose a good bean there. Allow me to introduce oh. you. Bye bye now. Sorry to cut you off, Leslie. Um, I was going to check and see how many tulips I need exactly. And this game does have a photo mode too. I just accidentally noticed. Oh, oh. Okay, so um. So we need. Five red rose bouquets, five yellow daffodil bouquets, um, five yellow sunflower bouquets, and red poppy bouquets. How many poppy seeds do I have? Let me find out that. We have two poppy seeds, so I might want to buy some more of those if I can too. Oh boy. Oh boy. Um... We bought the tulips, right? Or was it the sunflowers? It, it might have been the sunflowers, actually. Yeah, it was the sunflowers. I have not bought tulips yet. Okay, all right. So, um, let's look back in here one more time. It says I need three tulip cuttings, so I'll just buy three. What then. can I do for you, dearie? Mm -hmm. They are a little bit on the expensive side, especially since I don't have a whole lot. Of money. Okay, so we have three of those now. Should I buy more more poppies? So how many of those did we have? Two? They're only 20 each. I'm gonna buy a few more of those. Okay, all right. That's, take care. that's all that I can do. Okay, all right. Cool beans. <laughs> Sweet. Red tulip discovered. Nice, nice. Okay, so um let's go back home. And we will um we'll oh wait, this is not the way home. I'm about to walk home, don't mind me. <laughs> well um we'll go back home. Oh, and it's so pretty at this time of day too. We'll do some planting before we head home. I know it's already getting late, but I have a lot to plant here. Cool. Um, is it um 
Flu Flucin? Did I say it right? I feel like I butchered it. Another death joining in. It's so nice to meet you. Thanks for playing and streaming, of course. Thanks so much for making this beautiful game for us to experience. I hope that you're having a really nice day. I bet it's a, a bit of some, some exciting chaos going on for you guys with launch day going on and everything. <laughs> So I've been, so far, you know, just kind of planting these in a very uniform fashion, which I could kind of still do, but... Oh, um... I also wonder if it's, like, possible... Can you, like, uproot a plant? I think it'll just completely remove it. Which I could at some point. Because I'm, I'm not super happy about, like, the placements of these. But we can we can do that some other time too. For now, let's just um let's just plant some stuffs. So what do I have seed wise? I think we have quite a bit. We have um hmm, hmm. let's put our shovel away for now. And you can go here. I do have some more yellow daffodil seeds. And some more red rose seeds too. Oh boy. <laughs> Okay, um, we will put you there for now. I guess I could plant another red rose there. All right. And, um, I want to have some more, like, going over on this side. Maybe another one, like, right there. I've got four more rose seeds. <laughs> Technically, I probably don't need to plant all of these, but the the need to use up everything. I'm 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 I, I I'm having a need right now. And I guess if you know we get if we get tired of them, I can always you know chop all the cuttings and remove the plant, and we can put something else there. Right, right. Right now, I'm just kind of like, wherever it fits, I sit. I do still have two more, though, and I'm not quite sure where I want to put these. Um, maybe, like, one there. And we'll put another one there. Okay, all right. That's all of those. <laughs> so, what about everything else? Man, it's going to be fun um, watering all of these. That's something I just kind of forgot a little bit about. Uh-huh. Yeah, because we, we have to do that, too, don't we? Oh, Okay, well, this will be interesting. Kind of got some extra room in there. Mm. Could have maybe done another plant, but we'll just do that and this. Then I have sunflowers. Oh boy. <laughs> we'll put a sunflower there. Maybe another one, like, here? And there? I put another one, like, here? Sure. Um, put, like, one, like, chillin' with a tree. Sure, we'll do that, too. Okay, I still have poppies and tulips to plant. Oh, boy. <laughs> Maybe we'll do some of those, like, uh, along the, the water's edge. one more of these. Um, I'll just plant you there. And then three, three tulips and we're done. <laughs> um, where? <laughs> I could, I could plant some randomly throughout the garden. They don't have to be along the edges, I suppose. I do have a spot there. Let's do that. And um, maybe one right there too. Okay, all right. This is this is fine. <laughs> Hi Adam, welcome in. How are you? I hope that you're having a nice day. Welcome, welcome. Hope that Thursday's been treating all of you guys well with the uh, weekend coming up. Do you have any special plans? All right. 
so we are going to uh, start watering everything. <laughs> Definitely, it's a little bit difficult to like tell, especially like with it being like this late at night, if I've watered everything or not. You can kind of see the difference in the soil. Get that one. I think we got that one. I was about to say we're about out of water. Yeah, let's go and fill up. Your plant is happy. Remove it. <laughs> Poor plant. <laughs> this is why we can't have nice things. And things are going well, Adam. Yeah, we uh, just started up this new game today called Garden Life. It literally just came out and it's been a uh, super cozy so far. You get to like design your own garden and um, I, I'm i just kind of planting things very willy nilly nonchalant right now, but I'm hoping we can make something beautiful. Oh my gosh, I think our ivy plant is starting to grow. Well, that's so nice. So yeah, one thing I do wish is I've noticed like once a plant starts to grow, it'll have this like water like um, animation like come out from it. I wish it did that at the seedling stage too. It would be like so much easier to tell if something's like finished being watered or not. Some more water. We'll be finished one day. Thanks for bearing with. <laughs> Going on an overnight trip uh, from Friday evening to Saturday evening to a crocodile zoo with Uni. Oh gosh, Adriana. Now normally when you guys go on any trips of any kind, I'm like, oh, please take pictures and share them with me. I'm going to ask you don't share any pictures from that one. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> but I hope you have a lovely time. <laughs> mm, this looks great, but I'm uh, gonna be too busy with IRL gardening soon. Oh, Cam, what are you growing? I, water I think so. Can I water these? Yeah, we did those. Okay, all right. I think everything is watered now. I think so. We do have um, some of this quick growth fertilizer still. I would like to use on some of these. And we have some more right here too. Okay. So, um, I should have paid better attention to like what I actually planted where I'll probably use it on some of these because I know these are like some poppies and tulips. And I do need those pretty quickly. So yeah, look at the little fishies swimming through the stream. This is the first time I've noticed that. Yeah, I don't think you have to use like a whole lot. Well, maybe. I'm still kind of confused on like how much you need to use on there for the, um, for the fertilizer. I guess when the blue dots like just stop showing up, that's that's my guess at least right now. But it's before I used way too much fertilizer, and now I'm I'm nervous. See, here's like some little dots, but then we can make them bigger. So I'm like, hmm, do I need to keep using more? Um, I guess we've done all that we can here today. I think. I think so. Yeah. All right. It told me to go home a long time ago, so let's go and get some sleep. <laughs> mm. I think there's other things there, but mostly mostly crocs. So we'll share photos of the other man animals. Appreciate you, Adriana. Sounds good. Um, legally blind design. Welcome in too. Started a list of things I want to plant in my yard this year. I keep looking out at my yard and visualizing and planning. Oh, what are some of your thoughts? What do you want to add in there? I did get a cool looking hanging pot that I want to put ivy in. Oh, in your sunroom. Kim, that's going to be so cozy. 
Definitely want to do jalapenos in the garden box. Ooh. And we'll, uh, ideas for outside at this point. It's primrose, aster, marigolds. Gosh. Any of you guys' plants and gardens would love to see them. Good morning. Work was a bit rough last night. I want to do some drawing just to get out of my own head. Do you think you could give me some white uh, hellebores to use for reference, please? I'm working on a fantasy version of the woods where Robin and I first found them. Thanks, Lori. Deliver the white hellebore cuttings. So I think we need to go and get some more seeds from Granny. Um, she, she, I guess she could have just written in one letter as opposed to two. Uh, here she is again. Hey there. I was wondering if you happen to have any spare rose cuttings. I have so many. I was literally just about to sell them. They were Robin's favorite, and I thought it would be lovely to have them in the apartment as a heartfelt reminder. Thank you, Lori. We can literally deliver those right now. So let's go here and this one. Full to deliver. There we go. All right. Got a little bit of some money. Feels good, man. Feels good. Okie dokes. Awesome. So how is our garden looking? Guys, look. So yeah, the stuff that we put the fertilizer on, it it already finished growing, so that's quite nice. Heck yeah, heck yeah. Okay, so we'll need to uh, do some harvesting here, some some clippings, because we have a lot of uh, requests at this point. Hopefully we can knock out some of them today. Before we do though, I do really need to run to the little streamer's room. So anybody else who might need to run to the little, little viewer's room, now but might be an excellent time to do so. Um, if you need any gnomes, some drinks, some stretches, um, also remember to take your vitamins, your supplements, your medication if you haven't done that today. Now would be a good time for that too. But yeah, just give me five minutes. I promise I won't take too long at all. I really appreciate you guys' patience. And I will be right back.
Thank you, thank you so very much. I'm patient. 
while I was on that break. I appreciate you and um, anybody else who may have taken a break while I was away. I hope that you had a really nice one too. Hope you took care of yourself. For me, I went to the little streamer's room. I um, got some more water and I may or may not have had a couple bats of some chips and salsa. So thank you. Thanks for the patience. <laughs> Going to have to uh, go as I have to uh, have a talk with one of one of my societies, but hopefully can pop back in before the end of stream. Adriana, I I don't know what you mean by uh, societies. I wish I had societies. That sounds very fancy, also a little cryptic. But I hope that your society talks go well. <laughs> thanks for uh, thanks for being here, friend. I appreciate you. All right. So, uh, shall we get back into the game over here? Kevin, thank you for the welcome back. I appreciate you a lot. Always make me feel so welcome. So, um, let's get back into it here. And, uh, I say let's get back into it. Hang on one second. I meant to say this at the beginning of stream as I normally do, so I apologize that I didn't. But I wanted to say, um, some special thank yous to Anissa, Susie, Ace, that cloud. Umbra, um, Still Alive Games, um, Cantor, and Daniel. Thank you guys so much for all the retweets on Twitter. I really appreciate you letting your friends know about the good old Late Lady channel. Really appreciate you. And hey, Dr. Scum, three stream streak, let's go. Thank you, thank you so much for the support. How are you? I hope that you're having a great day as well. Alrighty, so, oh, oh. Oh, oh hello. I had a feeling we were going to play this today. Hmm. Also, all of the hair looks fantastic. Thank you. Did you know that in addition to water, trees get really happy when they drink root beer? <laughs> this is this is news to me, but I'll remember that for next time. Robert, thank you so much for 42 months of resubage. Guys, can we get some hype in chat for Robert over there? AK hey, serious wolf. Robert, I appreciate you. Yeah, it was funny. Um, Robert, uh, message earlier uh, today in a in a Discord server we're in, and was like, "Yeah, I was looking at at Garden Life and was about to send it over Wade's way, thinking that she'd be interested in it, and lo and behold, she already owned it." And I'm like, "Yep, yep." <laughs> you you mentioned cozy game. I have cozy game. <laughs> But thanks for thinking of me, friend. I do hope you're having a good one. Um, so, so, um, look at our big sunflower, too. Oh, she's just so majestic. She's a little bit turned around. I wish I had been able to, like, see which way she would be facing before I grew it, but I guess that's, I guess that's gardening for you. And with sunflowers, they typically face the sun. So, no, it's not doing that either. Um, but anyway, we have a sunflower. <laughs> so... Um, I need to, uh, I need to get some clippings of some stuff for some of our, some of our quests. Um, maybe we should focus on the, uh, request to build a garden stall quest first. Complete Leslie's request to build a garden stall. So, which, which bouquets was it that she needed? Will it tell me in here? I think this was it, yes. If we complete this, she'll give us 750 florins. Man, that'll be nice. Hi, Raspberry. Welcome in. I hope you're having a nice day. And Rob, thanks so much for the welcome back. I appreciate you a lot. I hope that your uh, evening's going well. So for the bouquet, we need red roses. I might be able to go ahead and make the bouquet for that, actually. Red rose bouquet. Oh, we need... You need 50 for a bouquet. Okay. All right. Okay. Um, what other bouquets did we need? Maybe I should write this down. I'm gonna write this down. So we need... Oh, and you know what? Oh, I just thought about something. So it's 50... Roses, I think, for one bouquet? And we need... Five of them? Oh boy. So, um, we're going to need 250 red roses. <laughs> All right, thank goodness I planted some more bushes. 
We'll also, we need five uh, daffodil, yellow daffodil bouquets as well. So that needs six each. So that would be 30 yellow daffodils. Okay. Daffodils. Okay. What else? We need five sunflower bouquets. So that's going to be 25 sunflowers. Ooh. Maybe I have some more compost ready. That would help grow some stuff a bit faster. And the last thing that I need is five red poppy bouquets. And nine each for those. So we're going to need 45 red poppies. All right, I think we have our numbers at least. <laughs> some of them sound a little bit daunting, but we'll see how it goes. That's one heckin' chonker of a bouquet with that many roses. What was it for again? Did he say it was for like a birthday? My carpenter friend wants some bouquets. If you make them for him, I think I can get him to make a little stall for the village square. I wanna say that like she did say it was for the carpenter's birthday or something like that. Man, <laughs> whoever's birthday it is, that, that's nicer than my wedding. <laughs> All right, well, um, let's let's get to it and get some clippings then, because we're gonna need them. We're gonna need them. Gosh, I hate to destroy my beautiful, um, my beautiful roses, but either they'll grow back or we'll we'll plant some more. One of the two. How's the music, guys? Is music too loud right now? If it is. Let me know. I feel like it might be. Or maybe the sound effects. I'll lower it a little bit. Try 80. Maybe 80 for the this too. Let's try that. Is it multiple bouquets for a complete or for a couple different requests? No? Just one, just one request. <laughs> so again, don't don't ask me what they're doing with all those roses. <laughs> How many do we have now? We have 22 out of the um, <clears throat> 250 that we need. Right. I was thinking maybe we've gotten enough from this bush and we can switch to another one. I think we're going to need as many as we can get. <laughs> This poor bush is going to be so naky. The, the ability to like trim like exactly like what stem you want though is is really cool. Like I said, I, I wasn't expecting that from this game. What's happening, sweet potato? Hi, friend. Thank you so much for the 20 month resub on Twitch. Guys, can we get some hype in the Twitch chat for, uh, oh, 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 oh. I've never seen it like grow right before my eyes. That was beautiful. Well, now we have more. Feels good, man. <laughs> Let's just cut it right on back. <laughs> sweet potato, I really appreciate you. How's your day going? I hope it's great. I need to play this if for no other reason than to zone out from the stress fest. Robert, you deserve some some stress free time. I know you've been like working twenty four seven lately. Um, so yeah, so far I'm like really enjoying this game, and it it definitely seems like you know kind of what you just described, just a game that you can kind of zone out, trim some some flowers, make some bouquets, call it a day. I'd recommend it. I would. I would. How are we looking now? Up to 41. All right. Is it the end of the day already? Oh, I'm not leaving anytime soon. We've got we've got too much work to do. This like bush here is so full. I'm like struggling to find the exact spots that I want to trim. Get like this one down here. 
Kevin, thanks for the hydration too. I needed that. And friends, thanks so much for dropping that hype in chat for our friend Sweet Potato as well. Hey, Squinkoid, so glad to hear it. We have an internal milestone Friday. Kind of panicked? Oh boy. I'm, I'm sure everything's going to go great. You've been working so hard lately. And I'm sure everything's going to pay off. So deep breaths. Play some gardening sim. This is fine. Totally fine. <laughs> Are you interested in trying what I work on? I'm always interested. Always interested. Is it related to that project that you uh, showed us over in DLT a little while back? Assuming so. That was a huge branch we had to cut off there. Get this one too, it's like sticking out a little bit too much. starting to look so naked. <laughs> oh man. I'm trying to be like precise so we don't make it look completely shoddy as opposed to just going like blindfolded. <laughs> yeah, you're starting to look real naked. Um Let's move on to this one. How many do we have? We're up to 76 out of 250 red roses. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. It did say bouquets, right? Not like, not cuttings. It did, it did say bouquets. Okay, right. I just wanted to make sure. I was over here like, wow, you know, we're gonna get 750. Florence for for completing this quest. That's a lot. And now that I'm realizing how many flowers exactly she wanted, you know, it's not really that much. <laughs> I'm suddenly feeling a little gypped. Oh, you can actually crouch a little bit. I was just like testing that to see if that actually worked. It really did. Pleasantly surprised. It does help a little bit. <clears throat> oh, didn't mean to switch. Um, a little like shave the top off a little bit. All right. We're up to 99. Oh wait, no, we have it. So max stack is 99. Um, we're up to 107 red roses. <laughs> I do have a lot of leaf piles on me too. Let's definitely go ahead and throw those into our compost bin here. Yeah, that would be helpful. Hey, you still alive? Welcome in. I saw that um, retweet over on Twitter. I was thanking our friends earlier for that. Thanks, thank you so much again for the support. I hope you're having a really nice Thursday. Send me a cheeky DM later with your email. Sounds good, Robert. Sounds good. I'll try to actually like remember to send it this time, as opposed to like the last DM that you sent me, where like I typed it out and never actually hit the send button. I'm just doing the most. Ooh, oh, I'm making this one look real naky. How many? Uh, I mean, we do have a lot of rose bushes. Okay, all right. <clears throat> so if I feel like this one's getting like too nakedified, we can we can switch. Yes, nakedified is a word. You heard it here first. I just love like the level of customization to it. 
you can like literally shape them however you want to. That's so, so nice. So um, let's do that one like that. We're never going home tonight. <laughs> So far, I haven't experienced any mechanic where it's like, oh, 2 a.m., 3 a.m., you're passing out. And Linus, like, found you on the front lawn. Half your money's gone. At that point, I might rage quit. <laughs> we hope you're enjoying our game. Have fun. It's been so, so good. Thank you, thank you so much for the support. Yeah, so many of them. Your dev team have come in today and it's been so so kind yeah you guys did a really great job on the game and it's it's very nice and chill and i'm i'm really really enjoying it me like a little bit off the top here just a little little buzz cut. All right, she's getting somewhere. Okay. Uh, we have uh, one hundred forty-six flowers. We're a little <laughs> we're a little over halfway. <laughs> See the amount of roses that we need. Then we have to move on to other flowers. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm sure the game anticipates like it telling you like, hey, it's getting late, take the bus to wrap up for the day. And I'm over here like, uh, nope, there's still work to be done. Can't sleep until it's, I can't do any more. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, these feel very short for how much you can micromanage and work on in your garden. I definitely would agree with that, Chad. Like, it's one of those things where, like, um, and typically, like, a, a short in-game day would bother me. Um, and, you know, I, I love my, my games, my simulator games, where they actually let you, like, alter the, the length of each day. So, you know, typically something like this would bother me. However, the fact that like it doesn't seem to penalize you or force you to go home even once it has gotten nighttime, I'm I'm just kind of like, well, meh. <laughs> it's been nighttime for three hours now, but that that's okay. That's fine. <laughs> but I do agree. I do agree with what you're saying. So what does the clock say right now? I know you can't see it. It's behind my webcam. Um, <clears throat> it doesn't actually show like time on it. It just shows kind of like little, little dots. Here, let me show you. It shows that. So yeah, it's, it really wants me to go to bed right now, but I, this is, this is my garden. We will, we will leave the garden when the garden tells us to, and the garden right now says there is more work to be done. <laughs> I have 165 roses out of 250. Man, oh man. and airs. Nice to see you. Welcome in. Is this a new game? It is. It literally just came out today. I've had it on my watch list for quite some time. It's called Garden Life, a cozy simulator. And as you can see, we literally have a garden and we take care of it. We like sell like our flowers that we grow. And it's been, it's been really, really cozy so far. I'm enjoying it. Currently it's on um, PC, PlayStation, Possibly Xbox. Um, but I know it's coming to Switch. I think March fourteenth. Get some of these side ones too. Okay. All right. And get 
some of the nasty little roots there. We'll take care of those too. Do some choppy chops. Can I throw some more in here? Oh yeah, we have quite a few leaf clippings. <laughs> oh, and over here too. We should uh this should make for some good uh fertilizer though, which is good since we're we're growing some more stuff. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Let's uh, take care of this big old rose bush. She grew like really big. Goodness gracious. Also on Xbox, thanks for confirming, Snarkonist. Looks so pretty and comfy. Already uh, bought this for Lauren. I think she'll like it. It's it's very nice and chill. And Ayers, I'm doing well, thanks for asking. Uh, sending all the good vibes. Really appreciate your good vibes. Thank you, thank you, friend. But yeah, doing okay. Been having a nice, chill week. We've had a busy week of, uh, of games. We uh, started out this week playing some more Palea. Um, and then the last couple of days, we've been doing uh, playing Nightingale. That also came out this week. That's been a really beautiful game, too. And um, yeah, then this came out today. I'm really enjoying it so far. Very in the zone. So I apologize if I miss any messages. <laughs> Cough, cough, Stardew. Yeah, with, it, you know, Stardew, like, you know, any game like that where it, like, really, like, penalizes you for um, staying up super late just kills me inside. That's one of the many reasons I love uh, good old My Time at Sandrock. Like, it, it doesn't penalize you at all other than giving you, like, these ugly, like, bags under your eyes if you didn't sleep that night. <laughs> It's like, this I can deal with. <laughs> Let's get a little bit back here, too. Okay, all right. That's looking a little bit better. Me thinks, me thinks so. Okay, um, so how are we looking on the, um, on the roses now? We are up to... <gasps> 214 we really don't need that many more guys we're getting there we're getting there and i've still got all these bushes over here that i didn't even trim so maybe we'll just do like a little bit of some trimmings to these this one. There it was. <laughs> Somewhere. <laughs> All right. Um, maybe we'll leave that one like there and then move on over here a little bit. Xanrock was peak quality of life, honestly. Everything about that game was fantastic. 100% agree. one of my favorite games of all time. Probably always will be. I'm still working on getting like the last two achievements I need in the game. One of them is like really tough. So I just kind of go back to it occasionally, play it on my Steam Deck. It's played very nicely on there. The controls are definitely not as comfortable as uh, they are on mouse and keyboard. Than that it's a uh, it's been quite nice. It's like Salt Bay. Sorry, by the way, I like am occasionally like clicking and like the game pauses. What's happening is um, I was saying at the beginning of stream, I did like an OBS update beforehand, um, and like it was apparently not good, and like my OBS like chat keeps freezing, so I'm like having to like click over, and like as soon as I click over, it like reappears. 
But when I do that is uh, when the freeze happens. So thank you. Thank you guys for bearing with there. Oh man, has it been an hour since the last one already? Man, <laughs> time flies. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Or do I have it on a lower cooldown? Maybe, I don't, I don't know. Britt, thank you so much for... Let me see if I can see him. He knows. <laughs> He was lurking. <laughs> he's got, he's like, <clears throat> hey, you, uh, you got any treats for me? <laughs> what are you doing, Bide Bide? I think it's your, I think it's your lunchtime right now, so I probably shouldn't be giving one of these to you. Shiny emoji, welcome in. I hope that you're great. Do you want, do you want one of these? All right, okay. For anybody uh, who's just coming in, this is my boy Finn again. All right, Mr. Finn, this is from our friend Brit. Here goes. Here goes. And all the treats today, my goodness. Back from uh, my silly interview. Finally, uh, time to try to eat something more solid. Jenna, make sure you don't overdo it, ma'am. But definitely sounds like some good noms. I hope that the interview went well. Here's a sweet boy. He is sweet. A sweet boy. Scrunchy, welcome in. Nice to see you. I hope you're well. Ayers, thanks for the hydration and thanks for the posture check, too. Did you like that, buddy? What? Why are you putting your paw on me? What is it? He's like, do you have more? <laughs> I don't have more, I swear. <laughs> My precious son, love you. Oh boy, what? What are you doing pawing me? What's with the paw? <laughs> oh, okay, you smell something? Did you did you have lunch already? <laughs> We're gonna go back on to a uh, screen here. All right, see you later. I'm going to close my office door. Give me a second. <clears throat> His dad just went on break. Oh, Scrunchy, do you have a cat named Finnegan too? That's perfect. <laughs> uh, he's also a good boy. So precious. Very, very good name too. Well, of course, of course it's a good boy because, uh, because it because it has a name like Finnegan, so just that's a given. That's a given. Uh, it was just an interview for the current position I'm in, but for it to be permanent, so it was a lot of what do you bring to this role? The fact that I've been working almost a year now, like what like a silly question. <laughs> I didn't realize you were working there uh, on a temporary basis though, Jenna. I hope that uh, everything went well with the the interview. I'm crossing my fingies. Crossing my fingies. Uh, you did apply for a different one that's a promotion, but it doesn't close till next week, so this one was just more of a formality. Gotcha, ma'am. I hope that everything works out with the promotion, too. You're so hardworking. You absolutely deserve it. So if I remember correctly, if you hit 100 subs, do you hit that, uh, um, do you hit that tier, right? So the way that it works, um, with the... The, um, I'm assuming you're talking about the, the plus program over there. So what that is, is the, the PLUS program, it's basically where if you get a certain amount of paid um, reoccurring subs for three months consecutively, then you as a streamer qualify for a higher payout from Twitch on all subs going forward. Um, so if we get 100 paid sub points um, this month, and then the next two months after that, then I'll make a 60-40 cut on my subs as opposed to 50-50, which will be exponentially better. And um, if at one day we made it to um, 300 paid sub points for three months consecutively, it would switch to 70-30 cut for me. So we're definitely not making it to the 300 um, this month. <laughs> I've seen some streamers make it there once they have like 
1,000 sub points total. But the way that it's tricky um, with the paid sub thing is it doesn't apply to gifted subs. It doesn't apply to prime subs. It's just individual people paying for a tier one, tier two, or tier three. Um, tier three point, tier three subs give six points toward it, and tier twos give uh, two points toward it. So yeah. By the way, the counter over there, it's been like wonky and like not actually updating during the stream stream, but like I noticed at the end of each stream, it actually updates. So um, if anybody's sub today and you've noticed, hey, it's not adding to the goal, trust me, it, it is, it's helping, but it's just being dumb. <laughs> so thank you, thank you for your support. <laughs> so do we have enough roses now? We have, I just need eight more, no nine nine more nine more okay all right we can do this we can do this what do i want to take from maybe this one Thank goodness. <laughs> um, hello? What is happening right now? Aya, thank you so much for that three months in advance of resubbage. Oh my gosh. That, that like helps obviously so, so much toward my goal. Really, really appreciate you. Thank you. Thank you for that. Guys, can we get some hype in chat for Aya? Really appreciate the support. Brian, I just saw your message. No combat? The roses beg to differ, right? <laughs> oh, man. Mm. Oh, that's cool. Nightingale devs just posted about an online-only mode versus... Are they creating an offline mode? They realized a lot of people apparently aren't happy with the online-only model. I did see a lot of people posting about that in their reviews. So they said they're... Um, they're working and prioritizing uh, developing an offline mode for them to release as soon as possible. That is so good to hear. I l you just love it when you hear game developers that are willing to listen to their player base. Thanks for sharing that news, uh, Snarkiness, because that's really, really good to know. Um, because like when we played the last couple days, you know, I, I wasn't playing with other people, so that would that would definitely be beneficial for me in streams. Uh, thankfully I'm permanent at the company, but just uh, this specific role is temp. Gotcha. Thanks for the kind words, friend. Of course, you deserve all the words, ma'am. Gifted count for the split, but not the eligibility. Ag exactly, Robert. So yeah, like once a streamer becomes eligible for the 60-40 or 70-30 cuts, even though the numbers that counted toward that eligibility don't count gifted or prime subs, once you do uh, become eligible, then you do get 60, 40, or 70, 30 on the gifted subs as well. It, it's confusing, but yeah, that's Twitch for you. <laughs> back from my meeting, Anne Marie, welcome back. How did your meeting go? I hope it was really great. So we can now make the when I just saw you can choose how many you want to um, make too. That's super nice. I thought I can only do one at a time, but if I use the scroll wheel, I can choose I want to make five. So yeah, let's use all but three of our our roses there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. All right. Well, we have um, three beautiful rose bouquets now, so that's quite nice. So here's the deal. Um, we still have some some other flowers that we still need to get. I need 30 yellow daffodils. So let's see if we can get those. Oh goodness. Oh, we dropped some more clippings in here too. I'm gonna run out of room in here. I think it does have multiple pages at least. Yeah, it does have multiple pages, thank goodness. <laughs> okay, so daffodils. Uh, was it 30? It's 30 that we need. This we might not be able to get all today. Because um, as you can see, the daffodils don't have too many on them. I feel so bad. <laughs> We're just making them look like little weeds. Oh. 
Um, Doctor Who, welcome in. Hi from Sweden. Hello, welcome into the stream. I hope that you're having a really nice evening. Do you like to go by Doctor Who or do you like to go by something else? We're glad to have you here. I've also heard Twitch is increasing sub prices. Not sure how much though and when we'll get added. So they, they are increasing sub prices for certain countries. I know um, Canada, the UK, I think Australia, and maybe somewhere else are amongst that list. Poor flowers. I heard US was going up. Really? Do you remember where you heard it from, Jim? Because I haven't heard that yet. That's not to say it's not true. I just hadn't heard that about US yet. Do I have any more daffodils or did I completely destroy them all? <laughs> How many do I have now? Oh, I actually have more than I needed. Okay, all right, 34. So that was kind of exactly what I needed, just a little bit more. Um, I didn't think we were going to be able to get all of that today, so feels good. Feels good, man. So we need to make five yellow daffodil bouquets. Here we go. All right, so we have those checked off now. And next we need 25 sunflowers. That I'm absolutely not going to be able to do all today because I have, what, like three sunflowers? It's so beautiful. Heck. I might need to plant some more sunflower seeds just so I can get this uh, this rolling faster. Because I needed how many? 25? And considering you can only get like one per flower, yeah, that's going to that's gonna take some time. So tomorrow we might need to go to Leslie's to, pur uh, to purchase some more seeds for that. Mm, you like games like uh, Deep, Rock, uh, Deep Rock Galactic and Valheim? Oh, nice. I've never played Deep Rock Galactic, but I have played a, a tiny bit of Valheim back when it came out. Tiny bit, tiny bit. Okay, and then the other flower that we needed for the bouquet was 45 red poppies. All right, so let's just go ahead and chop all of these. I feel so bad. They're, they were so beautiful. The tulip there. Tulip. Okay, I think that's all of my poppies. How many poppies do we have? We have 15. 15 out of the 45 that we need. Okay, all right. Okie dokes. <clears throat> uh, someone was talking about it in another channel. Twitch posted about it, but it only listed it only listed three countries so far. Yeah, I think that may have been the the post that I saw where it mentioned like UK, Canada, possibly Australia. Yeah, I I, I don't remember seeing anything about US, but I mean. From like a like just a, a business perspective, would I be surprised if they increased it like in the US too and on their other countries? Absolutely not. Um it's like, I mean, you think about it, with like inflation and everything and the price of everything else going up. Um in in some ways it's like, well, why wouldn't they? increase the the price of subs yes it does absolutely suck as a viewer i'm not saying it doesn't suck but realistically like it makes sense and i i can like attest to like from like a content creator's perspective like this is like my full-time work type deal it it has been hard at times because like you know in in terms of like inflation and prices of things going up like you know like 
me and Nick's bills are going up, you know, on everything, you know, electric, you know, taxes, all that stuff. And yet sub prices, you know, people are not paying more for those. Um, more people are not paying for them type deal. So it's like prices are of everything are going up, but income is staying the same. And it's, it's just like not leveling out eating out so so yeah I, I wouldn't be surprised I wouldn't be surprised wishing you a wonderful stream I appreciate you Toya it's nice to see you I hope that you're having a really really nice day sorry again guys about like constantly clicking over today I'm just like having some really weird like um OBS issues today um so yeah thanks for thanks for bearing with Australia, Canada, and the UK, but also the web oh, the web price for Turkey. Oh, that was the other one. I couldn't remember. Thanks for the reminder. Are there any other quests that we can take care of before we before we finally go to sleep? <laughs> Cause I do actually have some some other quests that need some cuttings too. Yeah, we need um three yellow daffodil cuttings. I might still have some of those left over. I think I do. We do need three red tulips, so let's do chop. Chop this and chop you two. I think we had exactly three red tulips. That's actually perfect. And do I have everything to drop these off? We do. Beautiful. Okie dokies. So we also need some more red rose cuttings. Some more sunflower cuttings. I'll have to wait on that. So yeah, we, we just overall, I think, really need some more sunflower seeds. Because that's what I'm like really struggling on right now. And also some, some hellebore cuttings. Because I don't have any of those seeds. All right, awesome. So um, did I actually water my crops today? I don't know if I did. Or watered my, my flowers, rather. I yeah, I don't think I watered them. All right, so let's do that before we go to sleep. <laughs> and and eventually, it's only been like 27 days that we've been awake now, but we'll uh we'll go to sleep shortly, shortly. I think I already watered that one. Yeah. That animation's like just so satisfying. Inflation is live job searching. My bosses aren't keeping up with the, the cost of living. Bless your heart, Arabella. I'm so sorry that you're having to deal with that. Are these, um, I thought there were like weeds coming from this plant here, but it does say the plant's happy. So maybe it's not weeds. Those do, they, they kind of look like weeds though. Not sure. <laughs> yeah, the plant just must be growing. All right, okay. Some more water. Is this, can you get water from here too? No, oh, so you can eventually get sprinklers in the game? This is like the first time that I've looked at this. Oh my gosh. Oh. Um, streamer question, are you using anything specific to stream on both YouTube and Twitch? Yes. Um, it's a, it's a plugin for, um, OBS. I wish I could tell you what the plugin's called, but I'm pretty sure it came from GitHub. Um, at the top of the plugin, it, it's just called multiple output. So I would like, if you're looking to do that, I would Google, um, stream multiple output maybe put like some keywords like twitch and youtube in there i've recently been thinking about um trying additionally like streaming on like 
TikTok as well. But that would like, I think, require like a whole other like level of setup. Because obviously with that, it's a like a vertical resolution versus like the horizontal. So one day when I find some extra time, I'll, I'll look into that. <laughs> The middle one had her first uh, long school day, so it was exciting. Oh, she enjoyed it. Tamoya, that's so cute. Precious. Precious. And again, fine with the uh, price going up. Makes sense, but the whole, you don't have to do anything. It will renew at the new price is really going to affect people and strip budgets. Oh man, I hadn't heard about that. Yeah, that's... Especially for people who didn't see the announcement. Because you know there are people who like just don't have Twitter or whatever and just didn't see the announcement. Gosh. Hey Gardner, when's the last time you slept? It's been it's been 87 years. <laughs> it's so accurate. Alright, I think we're officially ready to sleep. I think so. I think so. Um maybe one last thing. We'll um at the kitty. Good night, kitty. It looks like it's morning again now, but um, we're gonna we're gonna go sleep. Yeah, it's definitely daytime. <laughs> Are you doing story mode or creative? We're doing story mode, yeah. Hi, Alexandra. Welcome in. And um, is it um, Sai? Did I say your name right? Welcome in. I hope you're having a nice day too. Oh, this is the first time that we've seen. This illustration. Oh, and another rainy day, which means I don't have to water. Feels good, man. Feels good. <laughs> uh, obviously, it sucks seeing the rising prices, but also I feel like you and other content creators definitely need to be able to support yourselves and your families. That's so thoughtful of you. Thanks, Anne Marie. Being self employed can be scary in times like this, so I don't think it's good that. Uh, so. Um, I, I do think it'll be good that you're getting more money. Also excited to see you uh, get your split hopefully soon. Cross in our fingies. But yeah, all the, the paid um, sub support has really, really helped toward that. So thank you. Thanks so much. Hey, I'm a bit swamped with tasks. Man, what's that like? Couldn't resist reaching out to you. Any chance you could spare some peonies from your garden? I want to surprise a friend of mine who absolutely adores them. Thanks a bunch, Jasmine. Deliver 30 dark red peony cuttings. I think that would be another critique of mine for this game. Like, I definitely feel overwhelmed by the amount of quest it throws at you. Like, every day it's like, hey, we need like 30 cuttings from this new seed that you've never purchased before. And I'm like, Whoa, I'm trying to catch up on my like 10 other quests right now. Can you just like just just hold up just a little bit? Just just a little bit. <laughs> and then uh here's here's another one. Hey uh, we've had a request come in for a cosplay group who are preparing an event nearby. The in-game host is a vampire from a group whose symbol is the red rose. And they want to give the event some atmosphere. It sounds like you're going, uh, it's going to be really fun, really intense evening. Do you think you could help us with that? She wants 30 red rose cuttings. We might still have some roses on our bushes, <laughs> possibly, after all of, all of yesterday. <laughs> all right, let's get some, uh, some weeds out first. I feel like it's been a hot minute since we got any weeds out of our garden. Let's get quite a few of them here. I hate to tell you, it looks like you've developed a pest problem. Have I? Look for the cloud of insects buzzing around the plant. Oh, okay. Pests can be removed with a bug sprayer. Maybe Leslie has one in her shop. I may have already taken one. Um, okay. Let's, um, put this in here. Ooh, and we have a lot of fertilizer now. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Well, um, this will be helpful once we, and I don't have Just room. spray it on an infested plant before the pests can kill it. That will oh. shoo them away. Sounds oh, good. But don't forget, some weeds can draw pests away too. That might help you manage them well. Oh, interesting. Um, yeah, we have so much, 
so much fertilizer right now. I don't even have room for all of this. So let's put some stuff in here. Okay. And we'll take some more. But yeah, this will be helpful when I buy some more some more seeds soon. Soon TM. I don't have a whole lot of money, so I don't know where I'm gonna get it from, but yeah. Yeah. Okay, so um these are seeds that we can get. They're like sparkling. Um, <clears throat> um, it was like it lined out in there. I think there was a better way to go about it that will make people less angry. Are we talking about the the um the prices going up thing? Ooh, so this one is one of the, the plants that's infested. Oh gosh, we gotta save it, guys. Um, hang on. Where is my this? Uh we need to put you right there. Alright. And infected plant, treat with pest spray. Yes. There we go. Oh, you're looking so much better. Bless your little heart. Do we have any others that are infested right now? We have some that need some seed collecting. It looks like I can like even get two of the plants that need seed collecting. Seed collecting. Ooh, words are hard. <laughs> I'm I think it's a daffodil that needs it, but yeah, those roses were in the way. I need to like trim them some more. Hey, okay. got some ivy seeds. Ooh, and you you are infested. Take care of you too. That's a lot better. I like seeing them kind of like grow back into life after you uh, remove the pests. That's so nice. Anything else? Any other ones? Not that I'm seeing. Okay, all right. Let's hope that those were the only ones that had gotten infested. Um. And I thought uh, Sandrock really threw quests and commissions at you, right? <laughs> um, will you uh, be trying the Nami Lane when it comes out next week? Or have you tried the demo? I have not tried the demo. Honestly, I don't really know like too much about it. The name sounds familiar. Hang on, hold up. Let me glance. Is this going to bother me now? Oh, yeah, I have seen this. I have seen it. Honestly, I hadn't, like, had any, uh, any plans to try it. Hadn't tried the demo, but I'd be open. I'd be open to, uh, to considering it for sure. Okay, so, um, I think we'll start by, oh, what should we start by? Um, I do really need to go to Leslie's today and buy some more seeds. But my concern is I just don't have a whole lot of money right now. So I wanted to complete some of these quests before we go there to buy the seeds. But I'm worried that by the time we do that, it'll be closed. So this needs three dark red uh, peony cuttings. Are, are mine dark red ones? Oh no, I don't even have peonies. Okay, so we'll have to we'll have to buy those seeds too. Okay. I do have rose cuttings. We need some more sunflower cuttings. So let's do chop. Chop. Poor little sunflowers. Chop you. Chop that too. And this one. I think that's all of my sunflowers. Can we do a turn in there now? No, I need some more roses. Okay. Let's, uh... Pop some of these real quick. Ding, ding. Okay. So we can turn this in at least. To here. Alright, awesome. Um, what else? The bouquets, we're working on those. Hellebore cuttings, I need to buy those seeds. 
and some more red rose cuttings. I feel like we can probably take care of that really quickly um, before we go to, to grandma's. So hopefully, hopefully she'll still be open afterward. some of these ones over here. A lot of like stems on the back there. Sorry for the uh, sound effect spam guys. Just trying to take care of this before grandma's closes up. I think stuff is starting to go to our storage. Uh, since we're like so full right now. Yeah, okay. But I think we can get a few more roses. Running, running, running. We got some seeds here, we'll take those too. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> oh boy. Um, We have exactly 50. All right, let's go over here. And Dropbox. Deliver. All right, we are up to 290 florins, which is not a whole lot, but it's honest work. So we're gonna go here. You know what I just thought about though? Nessa, say hi to our guests. I'm here to buy some more seeds, but I don't have any room in my inventory, in my backpack, so I wonder if it'll let me. Oh, I wonder. I wonder. Mm -hmm. I get overwhelmed with that dream. I haven't played Dreamlight Valley in a really, really hot minute. Um, but uh, but Palea we play quite a bit of. I honestly kind of wish they came out with updates faster in Palea, because I I feel like I complete the quests like super quick. And then I'm like, okay, all right, let's 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 wait like another like month or two for the next one. So I'm hoping they'll have another update ready after this Maji market ends. Okay, so I, yeah, I don't know if it's gonna let me buy any right now. Since again, my inventory is completely full, but it might send it to storage. So what Hello, do we need? See you. We need dark peonies. We need uh, white hellebores. The shop is closed for today. I was just here. No. <laughs> I clicked out just to see what I needed. Oh, that's tragic. All right. Okay. I see you, game. Why you gotta be so rude? Don't you know I'm human too? <sighs> um, what else do we need? We do need 45 red poppies. And throw some of that in there. And what do we have in our storage right now? I have some leaf pile in here. We'll take that out and throw that into the compost bin. I have some more um, fast, fast grow fertilizer. Fertilizer, that's the word I'm looking for. Um, we'll put that in there too, just to free up some room. Okay. Um, let's put this in there. I didn't have any, I didn't have any like plants in these, right? No, it doesn't seem like it. Okay. All right. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. just trying to think what I need. So let's organize this a little bit. We have, we have the red rose bouquet that we need. We have the yellow daffodil bouquet that we need. So I just need sunflowers still. And poppies. We need 25 sunflowers and 45 red poppies. Okay. All right. 
Um, so yeah, let's um, cut all of these. And you. And that. And this. And you. I think that's all of my poppy flowers, right? Maybe? I think so. I think so. And yeah, we don't have any more sunflowers, sadly. Okay, alright. Well, I guess that's all that we will do for today. We'll uh, go in pet kitty one more time. Hi, kitty. Okay, so let's um, go and get some sleeps, I think. Didn't stay up quite as late as last night. I think, it, I think it's still nighttime, possibly. Maybe. <laughs> Because soup seems to be sitting okay on the tummy so far. Good, huh? I need to be horizontal for a bit now. You make sure to take care of yourself. What kind of soup do you have, Jenna? Did you see Paleo posted about the star quality fish and hot pot? <gasps> We're charming. I didn't. Did they, did they like say that you can like buy them now? The taiyaki and the hot pot from Reth and Zeki? Oh, I hope so. Oh boy. More requests? More requests. <laughs> Another new seed? I don't have any money. <laughs> I don't know how to tell you this. I'm looking for some cy cyclamen to add to the flower collection. As the resident volunteer gardener, I was thinking you'd be the best person to ask. I'd really appreciate your help. Jasmine, I don't know how to tell you this, but I have like 10 quests right now that I'm trying to complete as quickly as I can, baby girl. So it's probably gonna be a while I can, until I can get to yours. Cool, wow. Um, yeah. So, okay, I'm I'm having like a couple critiques about the game so far. I mentioned just in general, one, they throw a quest at you way too quickly. Um, I, I can't, I feel like I can't even breathe and feel like I'm completing nothing. Um, but also too, the payouts from Quest seem like really low, like compared to the prices for things. Like, um, it's like, oh, this this Quest here pays 80 florins. Great, that'll get me like one packet of seeds. So it's just, yeah, that's, that's a little bit stressful too. All right, um, so. Maybe I should start today by, oh, what should we start with today? Let's start by getting the sunflowers, any sunflowers that we can. I guess it's just one, all right. <laughs> Great. Um, <laughs> oh wait, two, two sunflowers, okay. All right, two sunflowers, cool. Um, and we don't have any more peonies ready either. Great, great, terrific. So I'm going to, maybe we'll, maybe we can put some of our fertilizer on those flowers again. Yeah, since I can't do much else right now, I guess we'll go to, I guess we'll go to Granny's and um, we'll, we'll buy as many of the seeds as we can that we need there. Afraid not, oh, are they not fixing the taiyaki in the hot pot? They're doing login rewards. Um, <laughs> look, Jasmine, we're poor, and that's all there is to it, lady. They really need to boost the economy in this game, that's for sure. Apparently, there's a problem with fixing the issue, so they won't have it done before the market ends. They're looking at ways to give us them after the event, but it hasn't been sorted yet. I, I hope it gets sorted. I hope so. Are you meant to harvest all flowers every day? I think you could potentially do that, Arabella. But like right now, I'm just kind of doing like what I can. Cause like with the flow of the game and how quickly the days go by, I don't know how they would expect you to harvest all of the flowers like before the day ends, you know? Cause it's like, like five minutes past and it's like, okay, time to go home. And obviously you can stay up past that because we've very much been doing that, but like it doesn't 
feel like that's what they expect out of you. But for money purposes, like in that way, it kind of does. If that makes any sense. Okay, so what were the seeds that we needed again? Now. We need uh, white hellebores, red cyclamens, and dark red peonies. <laughs> oh, hello, dear. I'm gonna try to remember those. Sunflower. I do need some more sunflowers, but let's get the hellebore for now at least, because I absolutely need at least one of those. Um. Well, oh, hydrangeas. I love hydrangeas. Dark red peony. And then red cyclamen. I think that's all of the ones that I like have to have. So I'll probably buy like some more of those. And I do need some more sunflowers too. Oh man. See you next time, dearie. Oh, come oh, on, so oh, long. Oh, I was wondering what this was. It was us getting oh, us some new seeds. That's what. Leather. She's in no oh, mood boy. today. Um Hmm, Irvin, nice to see you. How have you been doing? I hope that you're really well. What color are Finnegan's paw pads? I'm making fan art. Shiny, you are so precious. I think he actually has some black uh, paw pads and some like pink ones. A little bit of both, I think. Or are they all, are they all pink? I'm trying to think now. <laughs> I think he has a little bit of both. It feels like to get money you need to harvest a lot more, but there isn't enough time. Right, right. So how much of those particular seeds that we got do we need? We have to get three red peonies, so I should probably buy some more seeds of those if I can. 15 white hellebores, and then the red cyclamen is only six. So the red peonies, that's like a really big what one that we I need do some for more you, of. Dearie? Um, so yeah, let's buy, like, two more seeds of those at least. And then, um, we'll buy another white hellebore too. I do need some more sunflowers. Let's, all right, that's literally all of our money there. Oh my gosh, wow. Something that I feel like is really missing from this is just the ability to sell flowers outright. Maybe there is a way to do that, um, but right now it kind of seems like the only way that I know to get money is just by fulfilling Bye -bye requests. Now. And you know, like we've been talking about, I, I just can't fulfill the request fast enough for what we need. So it's uh, it's tough, it's tough. Bean inspection. I was about to do a bean inspection, but uh, Finn isn't in here with me right now. Um, he's uh, out with his dad since uh, since Nick is on break right now from work. But next time I I, I see his toe beans, Finn's not Nick's. Um, I'll let you know. <laughs> okay, so um, we have we have more seeds. So let's do some planting. Do I have some more rose seeds too? Oh my gosh. I really don't need any more rose seeds. So I might just honestly put those away. Maybe, maybe so. Jensen, welcome in. It comes a bit later, the selling thing. That's reassuring to know, but it feels like already like this early game. Like I need something. It's like it's it's very slow going with the money right now for like all the quests that they're throwing at me. It's like I just don't have like you you want, you know, 30 red peonies, right? But I have the money to buy like one seed. So that that's kind of like the predicament that I'm that I'm in. <laughs> Um, all right, so we'll just leave that in there. We'll put those in there too. Some ivy as well. I don't think I really need that right now. Um, but yeah, we do need the hellebores, the dark red peonies, the red cyclamen, and the yellow sunflowers. All right, let's, um, let's go out and 
find some spots. We do have some more sunflowers ready now that we can that we can um harvest up too. Let's definitely take those. Hello. Thank you. Um we'll take some more um some more of you. Oh I didn't need that tulip. Heck. Sorry little tulip. You were so precious. Okay. Alright. Um so where are we going to plant these? <laughs> Let me move them around in my toolbar so they're in the same, well, kind of in the same row. These need to go there. That can go here. And then this can go like so. Okie dokies. <laughs> Someone tell Nick to watch out for way he's getting his toe beans. He's just like like resting or sleeping and I'm like right at the <laughs> right at the feetsies taking like a picture. <laughs> oh. oh man, that'd be so bad. <laughs> the selling part is what interested me about this game when it was announced. Um sad that it's introduced after more than three hours into the game. So like I think what will unlock with our current bouquet quest is the garden stall which is what will allow us to sell but yeah just like leading up to that point it's like i i need it before then okay so yeah i don't really know where i'm gonna plant these um if i want to continue going like around like the edge of of here or if i kind of want to plant them willy-nilly um you know what, let's put this red cyclamen right there. And we have some peonies. Oh, these are these are bigger than I thought they were going to be. Okay. Um hmm. where am I going to put you? Oh boy. Oh boy. Um we'll plant you. You know what? I could maybe I could maybe start planting some of these like in the middle. I don't know how big they're gonna be either, but based on how big the, the soil spot is, it looks like it might be a bit bigger. And then let's do some, maybe some sunflowers. Kind of like in line with those. Oh, that's not very in line, whoopsies. <laughs> Oh, okay. All right. And then last but not least, the white hellebores. We'll do maybe one right here. And let's do another one right there. Okay. All right. So I do have a lot of fertilizer. So let's, uh, let's definitely utilize some of that. Got some in here too. Okay. All right. And... We also have a lot in here. <laughs> let's um take let's just let's just take as much as we can. Okay. <laughs> so, so let's um We're gonna need to water everything too, goodness gracious. <clears throat> That's all she wrote for that one. And maybe we'll put some more on the sunflower too. Maybe that'll help. Since we need so many of those. We have another uh, peony here. We'll take you. Thank goodness we had a lot of this. <laughs> Is that all that I want to do? Um, yeah, I guess that's okay. So we got all of these. Oh, wait, no, we did not get all of these. Sorry, little guy. There you go. That's a little bit better. And, um, I've got just like a little bit left fertilizer in here that I just kind of want to use up somewhere. I just don't know where. Are these weeds? Oh, these are weeds over here. 
That will take you two. So yeah, I guess we'll hang on to that little bit of the fertilizer then. Uh, we'll put that in there and let's put the rest of this back like so. Yeah, we still got a good bit in here. Okie dokies. All right. <clears throat> Lady Wade, the Toe Bean Boozler. I don't know if this is a, a, a title that I ever wanted. <laughs> Ooh, uh, fuzzy little kiwi. I like the name. Welcome in. I hope you're having a great day. Probably be about as big as the rose bushes. I think you're right. Okay, now watering. Uh, let's uh, take care of some of that. And I'll see if I can make any more bouquets before, yeah, um, before we uh, go to sleep for the day. Have them in your IRL garden. Uh, much bigger than roses. Are they really? I didn't realize that they um they grew so big. The more you know. Interesting. That one was already watered, right? There we go. Alright. Starting to get some of these puppies now. Oh, and this little guy. I forgot to um to put some stuff on you. We definitely need some fertilizer on you. Okay, alright. Let me. Get those out then. I knew we were forgetting somebody. We get both of them? I think so. Okay, all right, cool. So, back to watering. Got you guys. Get these two. It'd be interesting if, like, since these plants were so close to the pond, if they, like, auto-water themselves. Or the stream, rather. Yeah, a cool little feature. Some more water. Oop. And, um, we will pick up you. So, where did I leave off? I don't think I got these guys. So let's, uh, take care of them. Hopefully all of those are watered. Maybe not that one. Maybe not that one either. There we go. That looks a little bit better. Okay, so... That's watered now. So are you. We get these guys. We did now. Almost there. I think. All right, I think everything is water now. I think so. Okay, all right. <laughs> Let's uh, give pets to wow. Kitty. Hi, Kitty. And can we do anything else before we go to sleep? So we needed how many, how many things exactly? Hang on, let me look, take a look at my, at my list again. We needed 25 sunflowers. We have seven right now, okay. And we need 45 red poppies. We're at 34, so we're getting there. We're getting there on the poppies. All right, okay. Hopefully this fertilizer will help. And um, oh, we do have another sunflower over here. Let's get that before we go sleep these. I think everything's good now, I think so. So, sleeps? Sleeps. Let's do it. Will you and Nick watch the first episode of The Rookie tonight? That's the plan, Anissa. I'm really excited for season six, right? Did you like it? Did you like season six? Uh... Okay. At least the first episode. Rainy day, so we don't have to water. Feels good. And oh my gosh, you are enormous. <laughs> Y'all weren't kidding about the, the peonies being huge. Oh my gosh. Man, I I should find like a better place for those. Oh, are you being infested? Let's uh let's take care of you. Oh, oh, it's empty. It's empty. Well, how do I how do I refill? 
Do I need to go to Leslie to buy some more? How does that work? these precious little critters down here. These plants. Um... Maybe I'll go to Leslie first and see about buying some more... Ooh, refill pest removal spray. Wait. Oh! You just... Apparently, you just press E to refill it. Okay, alright. I don't know, like, realistically, like, how that would work, but... It worked. <laughs> Not asking any questions. Okay, so we need some on you. And who else? Oh, you need some. Yokes, all right. Ooh. Harvest a new seed variant for the first time. Oh my gosh, did we really? What was it? Red rose. Oh, we got yellow rose seeds. Oh my goodness. I'm so excited. Uh, oh, we'll have to, we'll have to plant you. Uh, I saw the purple um, strings coming from it. And I was wondering, I was wondering what those were. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. You'll get those bouquets done in no time. Thanks, Pambikin. Hopefully so with our, um, with our growing garden here. <laughs> All right, so, um, how are we looking now? I have 19 sunflower cuttings. I think I only need six more of those. And we do need 11 more poppy seeds, which we might be able to knock out today. That's better. Oh, this one's infested too. Gosh, a lot of these are infested. Wild Rose discovered. Was that another like yellow seed or? Oh, oh, it's just called Wild Rose. Interesting. Okay, all right. Can I, can I get some more spray in here? Yeah, there we go. Okay, all right. That's good. Uh, we can get another sunflower here. They seem like they're growing really fast today, so at least there's that. I don't know if it was because of my fertilizer or what. That's the only thing I can think of. Okay, and more peonies. How are we looking on peonies now? We have 49. I do have enough for those bouquets. Let's go ahead and take care of those. Red, uh... Oh wait, I keep, I keep calling them peonies. They're poppies. They're poppies. Don't mind me. Thanks for bearing with me, friends. Alright, five poppies. And I just need a little bit more sunflowers. Oh, speaking of which, hello! You grew so fast! Glorious day. Okay, alright. And you guys too, we'll take care of you. All right, how are we looking on sunflowers now? We have over 25. We are finally knocking out this big quest today. Goodness, this is going to feel good to get out of the way. Okay, sunflowers, we are making five bouquets. Cool. And without further ado, oh. Hey there! I see you got started on Robin's to-do list. I didn't bring it up because I didn't want you to feel pressured into it. But thanks. It'll mean a lot to Lori. Oh, no worries! Leslie says thank you for the bouquets, and unsurprisingly, she's already reached out to Joe the Carpenter. Knowing her, there should be a stall in the village square by the next time you get there. Oh? One more thing. You probably saw the thing on the to-do list about the pavilion. I think I'm gonna open it back up again. Oh! Could you drop by when you have a chance? 
I think it'll be cool to take another shot at it. Oh. Cool. Thanks. Great work again. Things are really coming along nicely. Take care. You too, Jasmine. Oh, precious. The civilian. Oh. I didn't know Jasmine had closed it. Well, if you've not seen that yet, you're going to love it. It's really going to be something else. I'm excited to see it. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy. Um, okay, so, so, what are our other quests that we have right now? We need the 15 white hellebore cuttings. Are these the hellebores here? Are you a hellebore? Yes, you are. Alright, so let's go ahead and take all of you. Sorry, little guy. I want to say I had another hellebore. Um, over here. Yes. We'll take you guys too. We have 10 now out of the 15 that we need. If I only had one more seed, we could have gotten them all right now. Man. Um, and then what else? Dark peonies. We need 30 of them. And with <laughs> all of these here, I think we might be able to get them. Goodness gracious. This bush is huge. Ozor, welcome in. Oh, a different uh, hair look today? I don't think so. Um, I did uh, get my hair cut like a couple weeks ago. Um, so so it has it has been different in that time. But uh, but yeah, yeah. <clears throat> I really wish my flowers grew this fast. Imagine how much money you could make off of them with like a little like um, flower stand and like a shop and like selling your bouquets if, if they did throw that fast. <laughs> I would never get anything done, right? <laughs> this is fine. Imagine the, uh, the flower growing streams. It'd be so satisfying to just watch them grow like that. How are we doing? Rose, dark red peonies. We need 11 more. That was just one bush. I haven't even gotten to these other ones. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Let's uh, trim up the sides a bit so they're not sticking out so much. You know, if we get some extras, that just means we'll be ready for that stall. Sell them there. Which we might actually have access to now. At the village. We'll have to go and check that out. Goodness knows I need it. All right, um, so, so we have well over what we need for that now. So let's go and turn in that, this quest. Yes, I'm down to only needing two more guys. We're, oh, we're making some good progress. What about the cyclamens? Did they uh, finish growing? Oh, they did. I didn't even like see them over here. They kind of blend in with the roses. I'll have to remove. I'll have to move that in the future. Remove some pests from those roses there. And um we'll take these cyclamens. And I think I got enough there for what I need. Get some more seeds. <gasps> yeah, we got white daffodils. Oh my gosh. How about from the ivy? We got pale green ivy. Okay. I probably need to, like, either m buy another trellis or, like, make one if I can. Wow. Okay. All right. Um, let's get you two. And look at our garden just coming together over here. That flower just, like, sticking out there. Oh, and I was hoping that we could make it to the village today, but it uh, has just gotten too late in the evening. Oh, <laughs> it's it's definitely going to get to a point where I've got to remove some of these flowers. <laughs> it's almost getting to that point now. <laughs> um, maybe especially some of the roses. We have so many red roses. Just want to make a beautiful garden. Do I have enough? 
of these now. I think I might. We do. 15 white hellebores. Sweet. And... Oh, I thought I had the six red cyclamen cuttings. Don't tell me I planted the wrong thing. Tulip, poppy, red peonies. Maybe they're in my storage. Maybe I didn't have room for them when I when I got them. Possibly. Possibly so. Yes, that was the problem. We have exactly six here. Okay, um, in order to make room, let me go over here and we'll put these leaf piles into here to make some more fertilizer. And pet the kitty. We'll take these. Blue daffodil, white daffodil. Let's definitely plant that since that's new. Red tulip, pale green ivy. That's new as well. Okay. Um, yellow rose, that's new. Red rose is not new. Let's put that away. Wild rose, that is new. We've got a lot of stuff on us right now. Goodness. But, but, um, we are... I was about to say officially done with our quest. We have something else over here. <laughs> so not quite, not quite. Um, Jasmine now wants five dark red peonies and five red tulip cuttings. I think we can actually take care of that right now. I think so. It was like five of each. I might actually already have some of those on me. Hang on, let me, let me check and see. Yeah, I have plenty of peonies. I just need four more tulips. I haven't harvested any of those today, I don't think. So let's get one... Two, three, do I not have a fourth one? Oh, that's tragic. I wonder, I wonder if we can get any more before the, before we leave for today or since it's already nighttime, we not, we might not be able to. Oh, that's really tragic. <laughs> okay, all right. Well, um, let's plant some more seeds. Boy, I'm, I might have to remove some of my flowers. I hate to do it, but I might need to because I've got, I got some stuff here that I just, I'm running out of room for. <laughs> um, hopefully more storage opens up with, with time too. So we definitely have like plenty of storage. Like it's like pages of it, it seems. But just my backpack seems on the smaller side. But since the storage is right here, I don't I don't mind too much. Okay, so um, we'll probably go to sleep. No, we'll we'll plant our stuff that we need and then go to sleep. Um, and we'll see about going to the village since we haven't been there yet. But before we do, I do need to run to the little streamers room one more time. So I appreciate your patience there. Also, hi Lynn, nice to see you. Garden life's been good, super cozy. How are you? I hope you've been having a good day too. But yeah, just give me two minutes, guys. I promise I won't take too long. I really appreciate you. I will be right back.
friends. Thanks so much for being patient during the break. I appreciate you a lot. Anybody else who uh, took a break during that time, I hope that you had a really good one. So earlier, uh, oh gosh, who was it? Someone was asking um, about Finn's, Finn's toe beams. I may have done some research when I was on break. And I was like, I think he has some black toe beans and he has some pink toe beans. But yes, I was correct. They were like a little bit of both. And um, I may or may not have taken like a little bit of a picture. But so what it is, is like he has mostly like, I think pink, like pink base toe beans, but some of them have like these like black spots on them, <laughs> which you can kind of see, kind of see. So most, mostly pink, but with black spots. <laughs> <laughs> or his toe beans. <laughs> oh man. Um, also, uh, James, nice to see you, buddy. Welcome in. I hope you're great. It was Shiny that was asking. Shiny, I was trying to remember. Um, Squirrel, welcome in too. Nice to see you. Bergy, nice to see you as well. Welcome, welcome in, friends. So glad to have you guys. And hey, Novi, welcome back. Perfect timing. How's the gardening going? It's going well, going well. I'm really enjoying the game right now. I will say though, I've been having some um, issues with like OBS and that kind of deal today. And like at first I was thinking it was because of like a bad update, but I was talking to Nick about it and he was saying that it could be like, just like since the game just came out, like some, it like not being like optimized and like we did definitely experience like a memory leak earlier. Um, so let me, hang on, what I'm going to do is open up, um, house manager. And like, just see how this is like looking as we're, as we're playing it. Oh uh, yeah, it's, um, currently using... 91, 92% of my GPU and 23% of my CPU, which is not great. <laughs> um, let's see if we can do something about that. Let's like lower this to high. Um, V-Sync I think we can leave on. That's significantly bringing down my GPU already. It's It went from like 92% usage on my GPU to like 73, 74%. So that's already a lot better. Um, and now it's only using 6% of my CPU. So that's good. Let's see if that kind of helps with the, um, the OBS issues a little bit. So what was happening is um, my Twitch chat was just kind of like constantly like freezing and blacking out and Nick was saying that could happen if uh this program is like using up like too many of like the resources so yeah thanks for bearing with me there friends I appreciate you is that a, a s24 I see yeah it's the s24 ultra one um I got it a few months back um so I, in the past I had a note 10 which is very similar to this and then i switched back to iphone and after switching to iphone i was like yeah no i miss i miss having that that android so a couple months back switched to this and um i'm, I'm glad to have it again <laughs> got some quiet time on lunch haven't downloaded this yet but can't wait i'm so excited for you man i'm gonna play some uh i've heard of pacific drive i really don't know too much about it but I hope that you enjoy it. Oh, this game is pretty. No, you. Jessica, nice to see you. How are you? I hope that you're having a really, really nice day, my friend. How's it been treating you? <clears throat> Shadows are always the, oh, the biggest culprit. That makes sense because, like, you see, like, a lot of games with, like, lower graphic settings where they just, like, kind of, like, kill the shadows. So, yeah. All right, um, I'm trying to remember what it was that I was going to do before I went on that little break. Um, Cause it's too late for us to go to the, the shop right now. Do I have any more tulips that I can harvest? 
I don't think so since it's technically the end of day. So I think that is like kind of one um, reason for the like the time of day type deal. It seems like throughout the day the, the flowers continue to grow but once the day gets to an end then um, they don't grow anymore which which makes sense which makes sense. So yeah. Um, okay. We have any other ones? No, I think that's our only one right now. So I guess we'll go to sl no. I remember what we were going to do. We were going to plant some some new stuff. However, I've got so many other plants right now, so I might need to uproot like some of my some of my rose bushes or or something like that. Something like that, because I've I've honestly got way too many rose bushes right now. So let me get out my. I think I'm crouching right now. I was like, why am I going so slow? Let's get out our this and which roses am I going to get rid of? Oh, I honestly kind of want to move you too. I'm going to remove you. I'm so sorry. And maybe we'll put the yellow rose here okay all right i did notice when we planted that it showed like a meter at the top um i don't know what that meter means not quite sure not quite sure i also have this wild rose that i want to try planting too and then we have some pale green ivy and some white daffodil I wonder if I have stuff to make like another trellis. If I can do that. Let's um take you. I should have gotten the clippings off of it first. I didn't even think about that. Oh well. Um, wild rose. We're gonna put you right there. Okie dokes. Alright. Let's put some fertilizer on you. And over here too. And then the white daffodil, um, we'll plant you right there. Sure. Okie dokes. Fertilizer on you as well. And yeah, last but not least was the ivy. Yeah, let's see if we can do anything about that. Do I have any trellises that I can make? It might be able to grow on other stuff too. Will it tell me? ivy seeds okay um it doesn't tell me in there but maybe in the plant book yeah let's look in here meet the villagers oh that's cool they have some pages for them too and then um oh you have like some more like tutorial stuff in here that's nice okay all right so i'm looking for not that i'm looking for like ivy oh did i just see it there we go. So it is almost also sometimes known as English ivy. A more accurate name would be common ivy, as this plant is planted to cover walls all across Europe. In fact, the Bavarian government recommends growing it for its ability to cool building interiors in the summer and provide insulation in the winter. Hmm, I didn't know that. I was hoping in here it would tell me like what exactly I can grow it on. Um. So I, I know we can grow it on like the trellis, but I was wondering if we could do anything else, like a like a flower ladder, for instance, or a um <clears throat> a a, pla a plastered door. Looks like a like a gate or a fence to me. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not seeing any more trellises in here, so we might we might have to um. Might have to, uh, whatchamacallit, um, buy another trellis. I, I mean, I might be able to plant this one beside it. I just don't know if it'll have enough room. That's my concern. It, it looks like it's letting me plant it there. I don't know. Um... And this one here honestly hasn't seemed like it's grown in a while. So like, I worry that like it's not in a good spot. 
Like, do you think it's like stuck? Maybe it does take a while to grow though. Oh, I'll wait, I'll wait on the pale green ivy. I think, I think so. Okay, let's go get some sleep. Welcome back belated, thanks so much, Kevin. I appreciate you, welcome back too. Love your galaxy phone. Oh, Robert, do you have the same one? Plant 50 flowers is the achievement I just got. Nice. And we uh, have another rainy day. Beautiful. Okay. And some more mail. Hello there, honey. I love how the garden is looking these days, and I was wondering if you could spare some flower cuttings for my store. You just have the magical touch that makes your plant stand out. Best wishes, Leslie. Leslie wants 10 red tulip cuttings and 10 uh, white hellebore cuttings. We can, I think we can pretty easily do that actually. Let me actually accept that quest. Um, and then what was the other one that I needed? This also needs tulips. Okay, all right. So let's definitely get our tulips today. We'll get the weeds out too. And some white hellebores. That was the other one. Ooh, did I just like, did we just like double fist that weed here? Uh, let's go. Sounds really weird out of context. I'm so sorry. Get some seeds, get some seeds. Tulip. And, ooh, other type of tulip? White poppies. Yes. Nice. Okay. All right. Cool. So we definitely need to plant that today too. Need to do some pest control on this. I might need to go ahead and take care of um, this uh, one of these bushes too, because I, I can never get to this daffodil. I think I'm gonna get clippings from this and then pull it up. I should have done that with the other bushes yesterday. But yeah, we'll get clipping since I think today we'll be able to go to the, um, the whatchamacallit? The stall for the first time? Okay, all right. And dig up, there we go. <laughs> So now, pest control. Uh, it's definitely a little bit easier. Get some seeds from you. Um, did something else? Yes, you need some pest control as well. Seeds, 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 seeds. And look at our yellow roses. All beautiful. Wow. Ivy Doomsday, welcome in. Ivy, you're uh, in the perfect shrimp stram. We uh, we just were looking to plant some more ivy. How's your day going? I hope you're great. Hi Wade, hi Ace, welcome back. How are you enjoying the game? I am enjoying the game. Yeah, it's been like really uh, cozy so far. I feel like this is kind of one of those games where you could just get lost in it and like chill for hours and it's like, oh wow, six hours have passed already? Goodness gracious. So yeah, if you're looking for a nice like de-stress game, I think this would, would this would be a good one for you. <laughs> you guys didn't hear anything. <laughs> also, Sophia, uh, your voice is so calming. Your hair is so pretty. You're so sweet. Thanks, Sophia. Uh, and the gardening releases happy hormones. Definitely agree. I hope that you're having a nice day, having some all the happy hormones. <laughs> do I have anything that I can turn uh, turn in right now? We do need some more tulips, but we can turn in some tulips here. So let's go ahead and do that. Okie dokie. All right. And I think I'm gonna go and check out that that stall at the market. Before I do that, I was just wanting to maybe like put away some stuff here. Like those red rose seeds, we'll put those away. I do want to plant the white poppies and put away the red poppies. And let's take out this. We'll put some more stuff in here. Some more leaves. Okay, all right. To the markets. 
to the market. My day's good, so glad to hear it, Ivy. Oh, why, hello, my dear. As promised, you are now the proud owner of one garden store. You did it, Is there? In the corner. Oh? Opposite the shop and the pavilion doors. Oh. It should be very simple for you to use. People will come by, hopefully before or after coming to visit me, and give you florins for whatever you're selling. Okay. Yeah. The next morning, you'll be able to collect the money from the previous uh, day in the little money box. This town is very trustworthy. I don't know if I would trust leaving out like a little money box. But what you should keep in mind is this. Some items will do better or worse in different seasons. Well, this game has seasons? That comes with the trade. I had no idea. I'm sure you can manage that just fine, dearie. Such an exciting step to take. It is. Uh, but this game has seasons? This is news to me. <laughs> Open garden stall. Okay, so, um... Will it tell us how much we'll make from it? Yeah, so it does say, like, price on it. It's cool. Well, um, I was thinking of selling, like, my rose cuttings since I have, like, so many of those. So I guess they sell, like, for one floor in each. Yeah, let's, let's go ahead and do that. Um, maybe my... Do we sell, like, some peonies as well? Because I do, like, have a... Those grow a bunch. Maybe we'll sell those too. And then maybe I'll hang on to everything else. Hmm. What do I need right now for my quest? We need hellebores and tulips. So maybe I'll I'll sell everything else. Like that. And this. And this. Okay. Alright. Feels good to get some stuff out of our inventory. <laughs> Okay, so hi, Grandma. Oh, lovely to see you again. Nice dearie. to see you too. Um, so she does have a fancy wooden divider here. It's blue and really pretty. I think that would help us with the ivy situation. After years of market dominance by the likes of R, M, and K, uh, something and something, the popularity of this regal blue lattice divider, produced by Luther and Luther proves the people are flocking to new up-and-coming entrants in the garden decoration markets. So yeah, I think that would work for our ivy. Could you also put it on like a fence panel? It doesn't mention anything about that. So yeah, we might just need to buy some of those regal blue dividers. I just want all the decorations. <laughs> oh boy. This is really looking like a cozy Wade game with uh, no, uh, no distress Wade sounds to be had. I think we did have some slight Wade noises earlier. I can't remember what they were. Um, what, what spawned them on? But it's been a while since that happened. What is this? The, dec the decor brush? Or to the designs we provided on our garden decorations, this decorative brush makes it easy to swap to alternative looks and styles wherever you find them. You can also find brand spanking new designs in stores where our products are sold up and down the country. Oh man. Oh, I need it. I need it. And sprinklers. Oh. <laughs> Why is everything so expensive? All right, I'm going to, I'm going to buy another divider trellis, I think. And maybe we should buy some seeds that we don't have, possibly. I have red roses, sunflowers, hellebores, tulips, dark red peonies. I don't have hydrangeas and hydrangeas are one of my favorite flowers. We'll definitely take you poppies. I have the dark green ivy. I have the cyclamen. I don't have, um, bleeding hearts. I don't think we have lilies yet. We'll take one of those too. Amaryllis. Iris. Uh, hostas. Lilacs. 
Can I take any more since my inventory is full? I wonder. Clematis. It must be going to my storage. Morning Glory. Jasmine. And that that's that's yeah? Did I say that right? Thank you. Come again. Oh, I'm so excited. Uh, let's go. Okay. All right. So let's go. We left there just in time because uh, it just reached the end of the day. <clears throat> All right. Let's go over here. I think I am gonna dig up like some of our some more of our stuff, honestly, because we've got we've got way too many things in our very small garden right now. Until we can like expand it like over that way or something, I feel like that'll that'll help. And like over that way too, it looks like we'll be able to expand even more. So that's exciting. But yeah, for now I'm I'm kind of running out of room here. So what do I want to um remove? Maybe some of these rose bushes again since we have so many, possibly. <laughs> Dog wizard, I like the name. Welcome in. How are you? First time listener, um, how do I, what, wait, what? Hold up. Irvin, um, when some, that's when some hero with a sword comes twirling in, wrecking all the boxes in the, in the pots for gold, that would be my concern. <laughs> I think it was at the start when you loaded the game. Oh, and the volume starlight. Like, yeah, Sarkinus, that's what it was. <laughs> paintbrush and the paintbrush was like 1000 so I'm hoping it's like a one-time purchase deal not where like I need to purchase it every time for every item because that would be really expensive really expensive I think maybe we'll we'll do some clippings here and I'll I think I'll cut down this bush And, hmm, um, what are the sizes of the seeds, too, that we got? That, that could definitely determine, like, where I'm going to plant stuff, you know? Oh my gosh, we have so many seeds. <laughs> oh boy. Um, let's put some of these cuttings away for now. And, oh my goodness. Um, let Jasmine, yeah, I, I need to come back for some of these because I don't, I don't have enough room. Maybe I can put like some of my tools away for now. We'll put away that for now. I don't need the watering can right now. So I can get the jasmine now. That's ya. And I think that's all of the new ones. I think all of these are older ones that we've previously had. I think. I'm trying to organize them a little bit. I wish I could like bring these over to the other side. But I think the only way would be to like pull them into my inventory and do it that way. Okay, um, so, so, huh. I might need to get rid of some of our Amy's bushes here and like replant them somewhere else. Oh goodness, oh goodness. Um, let's, let's do something. <laughs> don't have anything that I can put in there right now. Um, I think we'll trim up you and then remove this one. Now that we can like actually like sell our, our flowers, I feel all powerful. We'll get rid of you and 
Goodness gracious. Maybe let's uh, remove this one too. Dog wizard, you're saying, how do I get my breathing skill up? How I mine for fish? What what game are you talking about? <laughs> so I don't think there is any of that in this game. Maybe we'll remove this one too. What's that smell in here? It smells like coziness, Jim. I think you, your sniffer smelled correctly. <laughs> How's your day been, Jim? I hope you've been having a good one. Yeah, we just started up this uh, game today. It literally just came out today called uh, Garden Life, a cozy simulator, and it has been very, very cozy indeed. Okay, and let's remove you. I feel bad, like, removing so many rose bushes, but as you can see, we still have quite a few rose bushes. Yeah, yeah, okay. So, um... I gotta figure out where I want this other divider too. I'm kind of like feeling like I want to like move my other one, but I also don't want to mess with the ivy. But at the same time, I feel like the ivy is just not growing. I expected it to kind of you know ooh, go up the whole trellis, but it's just it's just kind of chilling down here. So I don't know if I planted it wrong or not sure. Not sure. We could. I was about to say put our other trellis like somewhere like over here like more in the open but and have something kind of growing on either side of it that might work however these uh big peonies are really in the way also the sunflowers too Maybe I could, um, cut down, like, two of these bushes and we can, like, buy some more. Maybe. Maybe so. I don't have the tulips and hellebores that I need right now, do I? We do have some more hellebores here. I think I was just waiting on one more tulip. Was that it? Oh, tulip. So we might actually be able to turn this in right now. So maybe they do grow after nighttime then. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, I was like, why do I not have them on me? Probably because I have like 20 million seeds on me. That's why. <laughs> Another thing that I'm wondering too, I wonder if you can still um, sell stuff at your, at your stall even after the day ends. If so, I'll take back these like cuttings that we're getting, and we'll, um, we'll sell those so we can get the profits tomorrow. Day's going well. Good, Jim. It was a productive day, and soon get to unwind with something very not cozy. Baldur's Gate Evil Run. Oh, wait. Hang on. What happened to my... I don't remember cutting it this much. I looked away for a second and then my peony plant was bald. Uh, hello? <laughs> did I, did I just go a little crazier than I thought I did? <laughs> I might have, I might have. 
Amy, welcome in. Thank you, thank you so much for your raid. I appreciate you. How was your stream? What were you up to? Amy raid, let's go. Let me uh, go over here and do a shout out for our friend Kimmy Mode. Kimmy and I have been uh, friends. Oh, never mind. Thank you so much for doing that. Uh, shout out for Kimmy. I appreciate you mods. You're the best. Kimmy and I have been uh, friends for a hot minute here on uh, the Twitch sphere. And um, she plays a variety of games. I'm curious to hear what she was playing today. But welcome in, everybody. Uh, anybody who might just be coming in through Kimmy's Raid or otherwise, hi, my name's Wade. So nice to meet you. Today we're playing a brand new game that came out called Garden Life a Cozy Simulator. I do indeed love my cozy games, so you'll see a lot of that around here. But I also love like adventure games. We do some puzzle games too. And uh, so if you like those kind of vibes, I hope that you'll enjoy the vibes around here as well. I was trying to like kind of have this like face in like a certain way, kind of like even with the, the post. I didn't do that very successfully. I think that might be better. Or would it be like that? Maybe like that. Yeah, okay. Let's um let's just have that like that for now. So, um is the the is the Fatsia, is that like Ivy? Does that grow like that? Let me, let me look at what it says about the Fatsia. It was frustrating, but I progressed in Ori uh, and the Will of the Wisp. That game, uh, or this game looks so cozy. It really, really has been cozy. It's super good so far. But I hope that you enjoyed Ori. Um, it looks like a beautiful game, but um, I, I've heard that it can be challenging. Hi, Robo Wolf. Welcome in. How are you? Came with the raid. Thanks so much for coming over. Kimmy gave uh, me gave me permission to join. That's so nice of her. We love Kimmy. She's doing the most. Thanks for for coming along, even with that permission. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. So yeah, with this game, uh, as you can see, you like grow your own garden. You can like do quests and like sell the flowers that you grow. So it's uh it's been very very chill so far. So the Fatsia, it is native to Japan and southern Korea. The Fatsia is sometimes known as a castor oil plant, which is odd, as it has no actual relation to castor oil. Its name is a romanized approximation of the Japanese word for eight. Oh, hmm. Does it have like eight leaves? Mm -mm 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 -mm. This one has six, it looks like, but maybe some of them have eight. Referring to the plant's eight eight leaf lobes. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Also, while I was gone, got over sixteen hundred letters mailed out. Nicely done, Ace. Proud of you, friend. Hope you've been able to get a break since then. Friend of Kimmy's is a friend of mine. All shucks. <laughs> Thanks so much for supporting Kimmy as well. Appreciate you guys. This is why I played on easy. Oh, if I played that game, I would absolutely have to do it on easy too. Still hard, but I'm enjoying it. Good. Was stuck for two hours though today. Bless your heart, Kimmy. Gosh. Um, with that said, if you do need to take a break after that long stream, um, please make sure to do so. Make sure to get you some, some noms, drinks, rest, whatever you need. But I'm really grateful that you and your community are here. Thanks so much for coming over. That really means a lot. So it doesn't look like this one requires like a trellis, but I can put my pale green ivy over here. I just don't want to get it too close. I, I worry that I got the other one too close. Hopefully this won't be too far away. All right, I'm going to plant you. Oh, try that again. I'm going to plant you right there. Hopefully that'll be okay. It's not exactly center. That's bothering me a little bit, but okay. And um, I think I have some more ivy in here too that we could also plant. I've got three more in here, so I probably could have, like, moved that over a little bit. But you know what we can do? We can move the trellis. We can move the trellis at least. To accommodate this. I think. Maybe. You don't have to do the trellis, like, right on top of it, right? I just feel so conflicted on how to grow. How to grow the ivy. Oh, let's, um, let's try like that. And... Dark green ivy, we'll do 
one there, and then boop, and boop. We'll see if any of those grow onto it. All right, um, so let's also get, um, put you, oh, oh. Didn't know you could even do that. <laughs> Let's uh, clip that peony there since it's sticking out so much. <clears throat> also, a uh, Robo Wolf, thanks so much for the support. Anybody who's followed today, I really, really appreciate you. Thank you, thank you. Was that thinking of going to get some sleep? Thanks for the warm welcome as always, and I uh, hope you have the most cozy time. Definitely cozy with you and your community here. Thanks so much, ma'am. Please get some good rest, and um, I hope I can catch your next stream stream. It's always so good to see you, Kimmy. Hope you have some sweet dreams. Guys, please make sure to say goodbye to our friend Kimmy over there. Is is this infested right now? I don't think so. I think it's just like flies coming up from it since it's compost. That's what I think. I, I just had never really noticed that before. Okay, um, now, where to plant things? <laughs> This fence needs a little bit of uh, some TLC. I wonder if we'll be able to do that in the future. So let's plant some jasmine. Oop. And what else? A lot, a lot else. Goodness. Um, we're gonna put that in there to compost. Let's move that there. Um, I can probably use up a little bit of that fertilizer. There we go. So let's move this stuff down below. Ooh, I can I can move those flowers up as well. I don't know need those in my toolbar. Okay, do I have anything small? My drainage is gonna be big for sure. That's that's pretty gosh darn small. Let's do this one. I feel like that would be a good spot for that. Maybe I could do the small one in the middle. Yeah. All right, so we'll plant you like there. And then little itty bitty little baby one can go right here. Okay, all right, cool. Yeah, let me, let me get some more fertilizer out. Oh, it's in this one, isn't it? Yeah, it's in this one. Maybe I should get a couple of them, since we have a few more seeds to do. Okay, um, and a lot of them are really big ones. <laughs> so it's like, hmm, where are we going to put you? We could maybe do like the hydrangea here. Okay. We have a pink bleeding heart. That sounds concerning. Um. Maybe I'll chop down this rose bush too and put something else over here. Could have done the hydrangea, I guess. Jim, thanks for the hydration. I appreciate you. Hope you're staying hydrated as well. Robo Wolf heading out too. Uh, gonna join a call with some friends. I hope you guys have a good time. Enjoy the games. Thanks so much for coming over in that raid and hope to see you again soon. Mm, wait, I know you're covered in rain, but don't forget to absorb some water yourself. Thanks so much for looking out for me. It's, uh, gardening is thirsty work. Okay, and then we'll do this. And... Pink Bleeding Heart's big. The... the... Fatsia? Fatsia is really big too? Um... And we still have all of these seeds in here too. <laughs> um, some of those I don't need to plant though. Like I'm seeing like red rose, that's a duplicate. We'll put you... Um... In here. Lily, that's new. Amaryllis. Iris. Asta. White poppy and yeah, pale blue lilac. I think all of those are new. Okay. Um. Okay. We'll throw some more leaf piles in there. Let's um. 
put those there. We'll take some more seeds. Okay. And what are the size of these? This one's medium, large, large, uh, small, and a large. Hmm. I guess I'll try the pink bleeding heart over here. And let's put this amaryllis beside it since that's on the smaller side. Okay. Oh, look at, uh, are these, uh, white, uh, daffodils? Daffodils. I think that's the first time I've seen our white daffodils. So cute. Okay, um, hmm. I'm gonna put the Batsia here. Do that. Okay. And then we have these three remaining. Technically five remaining. Oh gosh, I thought I like chopped down like so much stuff. And I was like, yeah, we'll have plenty of room now. <laughs> About that. About that. We do have room for something big over here. Maybe the hosta? I'll put the hosta here. I like hostas. Um, <clears throat> maybe we'll put this little, little poppy, the white poppy there. Okay, um, we'll put the iris here. I still have blue lilac and red lily, and we'll be okay. <laughs> Got some room in here. Let's um, let's plant you there, and then um, maybe this here. Okay. All right. Cool. So now I have everything planted. I believe. So, I just kind of need to go around and put some fertilizer on these. Only problem is, since it's like so dark, it's kind of hard to tell what needs fertilizer and what doesn't. It has been nighttime for a very long time, and it's raining, so that doesn't help. I'm going to try to put a little bit on the ivy plant there, too. You need to make sure to put some on the other ones as well. Omni, welcome in. I hope you're having a good day, my friend. <clears throat> Last night, your wife broke your favorite lamb, but now you will never see her under the same light. It's like she doesn't light up the room anymore like she used to. Omni, how you doing? Hope you're having a great day. Does Omni even have, like, a wife at this point? I, I feel like we'll never know. Happy Friday, June. It is Friday, Junior. It is. It is. Hope you're having a great one. Okay, I think I got everything fertilized. Hopefully so. Hopefully so. So, since we have some extra clippings, speaking of which, I think I put some away in my storage too. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Let's see if we can go and sell those. We'll put some more compost in. And let's put that there. Just want to move some stuff around. Okay. All right. I think I think that's good. So let's go here. We'll throw these in for even more fertilizer. And um, and last thing I think we'll do is go to. Oh wait, do I have these? Can I turn these in? I just need some more tulips. Do I have the tulips grown? No, I think we need to wait for tomorrow for the last tulips. Okay, um, 
but I wanted to go to the village and see if we can still sell our flowers there today before we go to sleep. It looks like we can access it, so that's good. All right, so what do I need to hang on to? Um, tulips and hellebores is what I need to hang on to. Hellebore, tulip, so we can sell these, these, and these. Okay, so once this stuff sells tonight, we'll have an extra 368. Starting to make some money, friends. Starting to make some money. I don't know where I'm going. Aww. And now, let's get some sleep. <laughs> it's been a long time coming. The game's like, finally, finally she's resting. <laughs> oh boy. All right, what do we have in the mailbox today? Good morning. I would like to change the flower arrangements in the store again. This time, I think daffodils and poppies would be would do the trick. If you aren't too busy, I'd be very grateful for your help. Best wishes, Leslie. So Leslie wants 15 yellow daffodil cuttings and 15 red poppy cuttings. That shouldn't be too bad. Oh, look at this beautiful letter. I like this. Hi. I would just love to add a, a spot of color to my apartment. It could really use it. Do you think you could get me some rose and poppy cuttings? Thank you kindly, Lori. We sold a bunch of those yesterday, but sure, I'm, I'm sure we can manage some more. <laughs> now that you've played a good minute, any, uh, any big starting tips? Um, so I'd say like when I first started, I was kind of on the, under the impression that like I really needed to be like reserving about how many cuttings I did on each um there it was again guys do you hear it Woo! <laughs> um i was worried i needed to be like really reserving about like how much you kind of trim back and and prune and cut the flowers you know being like oh i don't know how fast they're gonna grow back but they grow back really fast so you can like literally just like cut it completely like to the ground cut off all the flowers and like next day it'll be looking pristine again um, especially if you use, use fertilizer on it, no, don't need to worry at all. Um, so yeah, I'd say like cut everything as much as you have time and patience for and save it for when you can actually, even if you don't have a quest for those flowers, save them for when you can sell them and that'll be really beneficial to you. Ears, have you been playing it too? What day are you on? I just got to day six. Can you, how do you see which day you're on? I don't see it on the, oh, wow, <laughs> sorry. Uh, I don't see it on the, the pocket watch. So I don't know. Um, that's good to know. So like those roses, uh, trip the, <laughs> trim, trim the daylight out of them. Absolutely. I had so many, I didn't even know what to do with them. <laughs> G4, welcome in. I hope that you're having a nice day. Okay. So, um, yeah, today we need tulips and hellebores. So let's, uh, trim all of those. We'll actually need to water our garden today. Looks like my tulips, surprisingly, have not grown back quite yet. Oh, this one did. This one did. We'll take you. And, um... Uh, what else do we need? We need yellow daffodils and red poppies. Okay. So, you're a daffodil, aren't you? You are a, yet a daffodil. Cool. Let's take those. I don't feel like my ivy's growing. I feel like I did something wrong there. I'll have to look and see how the other ivy's looking. It pops up when you transition the day on the bus. I haven't noticed that at all. <laughs> I'll have to try to pay it better attention uh, next time. Thanks for letting me know. You're still playing. We are. Lithari, nice to see you. Welcome back. How's it going? It's going really well. Going really well. It's just like ultimate kind of de-stress chill game. I feel like I could just like, because I've, I've played some other like kind of simulator, you know, type games before, you know, like 
Power Wash Simulator or House Flipper Simulator, you know, like, um, uh, Pet Shelter Simulator, you know, all that stuff. Um, but, like, this one, I feel like kind of more than any other kind of similar game, I can just kind of mindlessly turn off my brain and just come here, trim the flowers, sell them, do some quests. Nah, uh, I'm, feel I'm feeling very chill right now. In the best way possible. You guys did a great job. Oh, hi. Hey, Cassie. Nice to see you. How are you? I hope you're great. I think you're on day 12 now. Am I, Novi? Man. I'm kind of surprised considering, like, we never sleep. <laughs> hey, so yeah, I know you like your, uh, your power wash. You were saying a new DLC is coming out for it, didn't you? So, okay, um, do I have any, uh, any amount of stuff to turn things in now? We do need some more tulips. I need some poppies. We need at least 15 of those. Make that 25. I had way more poppies before I chopped down a couple of my bushes yesterday. So I might have to buy some more seeds and plant some more somewhere. They're just so big, so the next time that I plant some, I'll have to definitely like kind of put them maybe in the corner somewhere, just a little bit where they're not invading everything else. <laughs> okay, all right. What do we what do we have now? Wait, did I just, no, oh my gosh, they were peonies. They were peonies that I just cut down. I'm like, why did that not count? Because I'm silly, that's why. I always get mixed up between peonies and poppies. To be fair, they're like same color. Similar spelling. Anymore. I think that might be all of my poppies. <laughs> I think so. I think so. Was that enough for anything? I wonder. That is enough for that. We got exactly 15. Do I want to turn it in for this or that? Oh, this one will give me 240. Yeah, we want this one. Okay, cool. But I am going to need some more for this one and some rose cuttings too. So we'll go ahead and trim some of those up as well. <clears throat> Glad to hear it's going well. The garden looks amazing. She's very hodgepodgey right now. Um, but I'm sure I'll get a layout that I like eventually. Thanks for the kind words. Did you lose your watering can? I just put it away in my tool belt, um, or my tool belt, my storage, uh, for a little bit because I was planting a lot yesterday and didn't have the room in my backpack to like carry all the seeds that I wanted and the watering can. So I just put the watering can away for a little bit. We'll definitely have to get it back today. Um, we have, do I only have four red rose cuttings? All right, what was it, 15 we needed? Okay. Since things grow back so fast, I guess I could go kind of ham on these, but I'm trying to be a little bit more reserving since I got rid of a lot of my, uh, my rose bushes. We looking now we have 20 so that'll be enough for that um did we need some more poppies we'll take those in case we do and we need tulips we might need some more tulips too let's go back and see if we have enough for anything i just need one more tulip and we'll be good for this one but we do, we do need a lot more poppies Speaking of which, poppies. 
And there's my tulip that I need. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. All right. So let's go and turn in you. Beautiful. And so I just need three more poppies and we can turn in that one as well. I was feeling a little bit overwhelmed uh, at the beginning with all the quests that we were being thrown, but we're finally, finally catching up on them. So that, that feels good. Feels good. Mm, is the uh, the DLC out on the 27th days? Oh, that's so exciting. And that's really close to your birthday, too. You seem to have a good handle on things now. We're trying. We're trying. The characters will love you. Appreciate it. Appreciate it so much. All right. So another another day bites the dust. Do 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 do. Okay. So let's put away this. That you and we can throw some leaves into our compost bin we can also take a lot of stuff out of the compost bin <laughs> we're gonna probably have to do a couple couple trips here let's take out our watering can too because i i do need that now um Get some more. All right, I think that's all of that. And boop, 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 boop. Then we'll throw that in there, this in here. Um, okay. And watering. Let's uh, let's do some watering here. Oh, or at least attempt to. There we go. Indeed it is. I'm super excited. You are uh, planning on doing it on stream, Ace? What happened to my watering can? There you are. There you are. I've been watering you. I don't know if I have. There we go. I think I just planted that one, to be fair. I still, like, question about that ivy. I feel like it's not growing in the way that it should. It doesn't seem like it's like growing up the trellis or anything. So yeah, I, I still don't know if I did that correctly. Get some more agua. Maybe not too sure. I gotcha you feel most comfortable with. But I'm looking forward to your birthday stream. Me and Hannah might have been talking about that a little bit last night, how excited we are for that. The climbing plants can be a bit finicky. I would imagine that they could be. Like, from like a, a game development perspective, I don't know how you'd even begin to like program that, with, especially with like how replacing the, um, like everything is. So yeah, I, I have like one growing over there and then I have like, like four growing on this one just to kind of do some experimentation and see if any of them will take off. I haven't had a need for Ivy yet though, like quest wise or anything. So it's not an issue yet. More water. And that sprinkler system sounding better and better. I did get these, I think. I don't know if I got you. I think I got those. But I don't think I got these. Here we go. And trellis. Alright. I think that's everything planted or watered. Hopefully. Hopefully so. Maybe. Maybe I should go ahead and get some trimmings from um 
some of these other things too. It's like I haven't I haven't done any trimmings yet on like the pink roses or the yellow roses. I just like to have those for like when I I do probably get a request for them. So yeah, let's uh let's go around and do some trimmings before we go to the village and sell some stuff. on here, my goodness. Can't even see where to sniff them. <laughs> really like tucked away in there. I was planning on getting all of them, but maybe we'll leave the rest of those. Let's uh, get some of these. I think this, I was calling it a pink rose. I think it's called a wild rose. I think that's what this one is called now that I think about it. doing anything special you you're right you are doing doing something really special uh take some planning but not as complex as you think depending on the engine for for my my brain it would definitely be complex for me <laughs> little bloop sounds make me think of like the supermarket checkout cash register. I hadn't thought about that, but now I'm never going to be able to unhear it. <laughs> I think I mentioned before, I like the sound. I love this, the sound design in this game, but just hearing bloop, 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 like over and over again, it's just like, all right. This maybe like once was cool. If the game could like detect like, okay, she's doing a lot of trimming here. So let's like not do it every time. That, that might be a little bit preferable. Okay. Is that everything that I want to get some cuttings of? I think so. I think so. Okay. All right. So, um, let's throw some more stuff in our compost bin. Boop, boop. And we'll go to the market. We'll list some stuff for sale. And then I think we'll get some sleep. Okay. Oh, and I just got money. Nice. I forgot that we hadn't collected our, our, uh, profits from the previous night. Okay, so daffodils. Um, the price of the daffodils for thirteen, I can get one hundred for money. Oh my gosh, that must be what it was talking about about like making more money in certain seasons for certain stuff. Man, I need to go back and get all the da. I'm I'm gonna go back home and get all the daffodils. Man, that's where the money's at. Oh my gosh. I'm so sorry, little daffodils. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Just like sitting my shears on you. Did it again. <laughs> Keep pressing the wrong button. I'm just so excited. It was money. And those are just like the, the yellow daffodils. I wonder if the white daffodil will sell for like even more. Okay. I think 
that. I think that's all of my daffodils. I think so. I think so. <laughs> Should we get some more sunflowers too? I do have a lot of sunflowers. Let's, uh, you know what? Let's take the sunflowers too. Some of these are getting like really tall. Okay. I think, I think that's good. I think that's good. Let's, um, let's go back now. <laughs> I'm almost done with the fan art, Shiny. You're so sweet. I can't wait to see. All right, so, um, daffodils. By selling these 37, we'll make a 296. Don't mind if I do. And we have some peony cuttings. I think I did need to save those for the... Nope, nope, nope. Not me getting confused by poppies and peonies again. Um, so technically I might actually be able to sell those. Yeah, let's sell those. Cyclamen. We did need rose, right? Yeah, it was rose and poppy. Okay. But we can sell, um, I guess these... Well, I was about to say we can sell these yellow ones. Maybe I should hang on to them since I don't have too many, in case we get a big quest. But we can always grow more, too. Heck it, let's sell them. The Hellebores, you make some decent money from those, too. Sell those. Um, sunflowers. Ooh, make some... Ooh, that is some fantastic money from the sunflowers. Oh, man, I'm cutting those every day. Don't need those. And... Wow. So we're starting to learn kind of what the big money makers are. The daffodils are great, at least right now. Um, sunflowers are great, too. Hellebore is not bad, not bad. We're learning, we're learning, friends. Okay, so, um... Yes, let's leave here and we'll go get some sleep. See what tomorrow has in store for us. Makas, I hope you've been having a good day. How did your um, doctor's appointment go? I hope it went well. Uh, funny how, because daffodils are uh, so easy to grow usually, would think they'd so Yeah, and we like have so many of them, but I guess it's just because of the season. <laughs> So it, it did just say day 12 there. We're, we're just starting day... Was that the end of day 12 or are we... I'm assuming we're starting day 12 now. I'm assuming so. I'm assuming so. I think we have time for one more day. Alrighty. What do we have in the mail here? Hello, dearie. I happened upon the garden a little while ago and I would love to display some flowers in the store. I think it would really tie in the whole place together. A few roses and sunflowers would be lovely. Gratefully, Leslie. She wants uh, some rose cuttings and some sunflower cuttings. Well, I did just sell some sunflowers, but I'm sure we can get some more for you, Leslie. And then, um, hi. So there is a patient in the hospital struggling with some loneliness at the moment. Oh, it's not strictly okay, but knowing what that's like, I want to do something nice for them. Can I have a few red tulips to put in their room? Thanks, Lori. Oh, Lori sounds like a sweet bean. All right, so we need ro uh, red rose, red poppy, yellow sunflower, and red tulip. I will try to remember that stuff. Look, some of our new ones are growing. Oh, you are beautiful. Which one was this again? I'll have to I'll have to trim it in a moment and find out. Um, so we didn't need we do need sunflower again. So we'll take you. I should have put some fertilizer on my on my uh, stuff last night. Man, um, I guess we could do that now since it's still daytime. Yeah, let's go over here and I'm going to get some more fertilizer out since we have so much of it. Let's. Let's take all of that at least. Okay, and what do we need to see grow some more? 
Oh, look at the hydrangea. I love hydrangeas. I'm excited to see what other colors of hydrangeas we'll get too. All right, so those are fertilized um, sunflower. I do need some of you. We have another one right here. Cool. And let's put some on you. And is this a sunflower here? I think that's supposed to be a sunflower. Kind of being overtaken a little bit. Over here as well. And this one is a sunflower. We'll take that. Take you. What else? I guess that's okay for now. We'll see what else we can do. Oh, do we have some seeds from the ivy? We do. Okie dokes. All right. Um, some seeds from the daffodils as well. Nice, nice. Oh, and look at these, like, precious little plants that we're starting to get, too. They're so pretty. So pretty. Okay, um, so, what do we need? We need red tulips. Let's start with those. Boop. And, boop. I think I have another tulip over here. Yeah, here we go. All right. We need 12 red roses. I think I actually already have that. And then the sunflowers. I do see another sunflower ready over here. And over here as well. And this one, maybe? There we go. What was this one that we uh, grabbed? Oh, blue lilac. Oh, the lilac's really pretty, too. I like it. I like it a lot. Are we getting a new sunflower variant here? I think we are. Purple sunflowers? I didn't even know that was a thing. Oh, I'm so excited. Let's, um... Let's, let's find a place for it. Can I, um... Mm, let's let's go over here and we'll get you in there and then let's get that purple sunflower and find a spot hmm um yes <laughs> I kind of just got some random sunflowers growing here maybe I'll just like put another one kind of in this line Okay, all right, there you go, little sunflower. Let's give you some fertilizer. And we definitely need to do some watering on some stuff today too. There we go. So I guess maybe you don't need to water stuff every day because I am noticing some of, a lot of them are like still like pretty dark. So maybe not. Oh guys, look, we're starting to get some ivy. This one really took off, my gosh. <laughs> That's amazing. All right, what uh, what kind of ivy was this one? Trim it back a little bit. Oh, I didn't mean to trim all of that off, but okay. <laughs> all right, this is the dark green ivy. I do wonder how much that sells for. Macus, did it go really bad? No. I think this was my wake up call though. Macus, I'm like so sorry. It, like you didn't get the, the news that you were like maybe hoping for, but I'm proud of you for going. And I hope that like they were able to give you some, some answers that will, that'll help you going forward. I should stuff some flower bulbs in my neighbor's mailbox. No warning or explanation. It'd be an, it would be a nice surprise. <laughs> okay, uh, how are we doing? We have sunflowers. I also needed poppies. Okay, let's uh, let's get the poppies too. And we probably ought to be able to probably ought to be able to um, which we caught uh, turn in some stuff. Yeah. Yes. Okay, hey, all right. Um, so let me go back over here. Do do do, and we have this that we can turn in. I don't have that quite yet. 
and we don't have that quite yet. I need a couple more tulips, a couple more roses, and a couple more sunflowers. Which we can get the sunflowers right now. We can get the roses right now too. And let's turn those in like so. And then I just need a couple more tulips, which we have right here. Perfect, perfect. Look at us doing quests and stuff. How exciting. Okie dokie. All right, making that money. Feels good, man. And we haven't even picked up the money that I made from um, from selling those flowers yesterday. Oh boy, why? Okay, so let's uh, trim those back a bit. And I wanted to see about these flowers. I'm not really trimming the one that I'm trying to trim. Oh, did I have to trim the whole thing? Oh boy. I guess so. Um, and yeah, inventory is already, already getting full. I want to say these made some good moolahs. Woo! <laughs> so good. Uh, the sunflowers. The sunflowers definitely made some good moolahs. So we'll take those two. Oh man, look at this this monster here. I think this was like the castor oil plant. Oh my gosh, it's huge! Holy smokes! Gosh, when I plant this in the future, I'm gonna have to put it in like a really secluded spot. She is taken over. Okay. We'll take some more of these, some seeds. Thank you. I don't remember making especially much from the poppies or the tulips, from what I remember. I don't think. Did someone say purple? Someone might have said purple, Hannah. Yeah, apparently we're getting purple sunflowers. So I'm really excited to see how those are going to look. Hope so too. Not looking too good, but I know, uh, know I've got it in me to improve. I know you do too, Makas. You can do it, friend. If there's anything that we can do to help encourage you with your journey, please let us know. This is new as well. That's pretty. Hey. Okay. Am I going to even have room in my inventory, in my backpack, to take all of these to the market? That I don't know. That I don't know. Oh, 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 I really cut that one down. Oh gosh, hopefully it'll come back. This one's beautiful. Oh, I love this purple one. Gorgeous, she says as she completely chops it down. Mm, fudge that. I like the name. Welcome in. <laughs> I think selling bouquets may bring... I didn't even think about that. Honestly, I didn't even realize that you could... That you could sell, like, the... I didn't realize you could sell the bouquets. Like, crafted stuff. I just assumed I could only sell cuttings. But now I want to try that. Okay. So let's, um... Let's let's think about this then. So I'm gonna write down stuff. So to make a dark green ivy bouquet. It costs um fifty ivy. So we'll kind of like compare that to what like selling, you know, fifty just outright ivy would be. So yeah, I'll try to craft that. And then, um, yeah, I guess we'll try the same with the, the poppy bouquet, too, since we have those. The poppy bouquet, that one was 10, I want to say. Jim, thanks for the hydration. I appreciate you. Time for me to wrap up the day. Have a nice and hydrated rest of your day. Appreciate you, Jim. Always hydrated with you. <laughs> 
you have a really good rest of your day, friend. It was good to have you here. Thanks for taking time out of your day. Okay, um, so let's also trim, um, let's get that, see how much that one is worth. And we'll take those two. Gotta take some of the hydrangeas. Oh, so beautiful, so beautiful. I take the daffodils. Another sunflower. Um, sunflower there. Take these. Is that everything that I want to take to the market? Possibly, possibly so. Let's uh, go in here and pet the kitty. Hi, kitty. And I can make one of these bouquets as well. Let's um, let's do that. Oh, hello. <laughs> Don't mind me. Just running into stuff. Okay, so yeah, let's um, let's take this and see how much we'll we'll make exactly. Okay, so take some profits. We are officially over 2,000 florins. Man, finally making some money. Goodness. Oh, heck, guys, I screwed up. Because I think some, well, I was about to say, I think some of our flowers may have gone to storage. Actually, we have free space here, so it probably didn't. Maybe? I'm, I'm honestly curious now. It might have gone to storage. Let me go and check. Is there a deep reason why you like hydrangea or is it simply because they're pretty? Yeah, I don't think any particular deep reason. I think just kind of because they're pretty. But I'll tell you, we, we kind of had this um, conversation a little while back. I can't remember what brought it on. I, my favorite like types of flowers, um, I guess they're kind of similar to hydrangeas in a way. But my favorite types of flowers are um, kind of like these, what are they, lilacs? And not necessarily lilac specifically, but I really like flowers that are kind of like, like long, like, like, look like kind of like long stalks that are kind of like in this shape. Does that make any, any sense? I know there are several types of flowers that are like that, and I don't know what draws me to them, but I, I just find them very unique and I really like them. I like them a lot. So yeah, any flowers like that I, I find cool. Oh my gosh, we, we have so much in here. <laughs> All right, well, let's put some more fertilizer away. Sure, um, okay. And we'll also put that in there. Some more of this out. Um, we'll put those in there too. We have some seeds in here that we can put away. Let's take this. I've got so much over here too. <laughs> it definitely would be nice if we had a backpack upgrade. I don't know if that's a thing in this game, but yeah. So maybe I can make some more bouquets after all. Goodness. Okay. Um, yeah, I'm gonna put some more of those in there. We can take some more of this out. Can I do anything with this? We can make some more of these bouquets. All right. Hopefully this will be some good money. Question of you guys in chat, any uh, flower lovers? What are uh, some of your favorite flowers? Oh, um. Okay. 
Oh, I can actually do another one of those. All right. Is my, are the flowers going over here? Oh yeah, they were. Okay. Or the bouquets rather. So, um, maybe then we'll put these flowers away in here and we'll just take the bouquets to the market. See how that works out for us? Okay, all right, let's do it. Love orchids and snapdragons. Oh, beautiful, Arabella. So we can sell the bouquets. I'm, I appreciate, oh gosh, um, Fudge that brought that up because I didn't even think about selling the bouquets. So um, for the dark green ivy bouquet, we, oh, I put away my ivy so I can't really test it. Um, but assuming with the ivy, like, you know what, I want to go home and test that. Let me see. Um, just trying to remember how to go home. Maybe we can bring like Ivy and Poppies back with us just to see if, how much more we're making exactly. Here's Poppy. And Dark Ivy, we'll take that. Do some science here. Love hydrangeas. Oh, incarnations for you too. Nice. Okay, so if we were to just sell the ivy outright. Oh, you don't make any money from the ivy. Oh, okay. Ivy doesn't make any money. But what's interesting is a dark green ivy bouquet makes 75. So that's going from nothing to something that's already an increase okay cool what about the poppies so one poppy sells for five one poppy bouquet sells for 88 um so we put 10 poppies into a bouquet which would come out to 50 so we're we're making a profit of 38 there so yeah you definitely make more from the the bouquets thanks again for bringing that up fudge man well i'm glad we we know about that now sooner rather than later so oh my gosh once all of this sells we're gonna make 1200 this is how okay <laughs> finally learning how to make money in this game and we're gonna be able to buy some cute stuff at uh at grandma's oh i'm so excited so excited oh i, I was going to water my crops however i think most of them already well, no, we probably can do some more watering. Let's do that before we before we uh, go to sleeps. And let's go get some more water over here. Getting all the stongs now. Feels good, man. It's so hard to pick a favorite flower. That's completely fair. They're all so pretty. Did we get you? I think we did get you. And those are fine, too. We'll take those. Come over here. These guys. And those those profits that we're gonna make from those bouquets that we're selling, that's not even including like all of the, all of the, um, whatchamacallit, like regular, like other flower cuttings that I got that are sitting in my storage. So yeah, it's wild that we'll still have those that we can make some money out of too. But yeah, I just like now, from now on, I'm probably going to hang on to stuff so that I can like, until I have enough to make bouquets out of it. Yeah, that definitely seems like the way to go. Hi, Tommy. Welcome in. How are you? You like the game so far? I need a chill game. Oh gosh, this has been like ultimate chill. If you're looking for something to kind of just de-stress, turn off your brain, I think you'll like it. You definitely have been. A little bit more? <laughs> Almost done watering all of my plants. <laughs> okay, uh, that's good. This is good too now. And these. All right, I think everything is watered now. I hope so. I hope so. All right, let's go and get some sleeps.
Uh, he's saying about games where you can turn off your brain and chill. Oh, achievement! Sell your first bouquet! Let's go! That's uh, you playing Legos and, and hunting the collectibles. Oh, nice. It's always good to find a game like that. Guys, I'm enjoying this very much, but I do need to start wrapping up for today. So, let's um, go and do this and do that. Oh, the music in this game is so, so pretty. Let me turn on some other music for us, though. Like, um, here, there we go. Friends, I want to thank you so much for being here, uh, for us playing this this new game today. Um, whether you were watching on YouTube or on Twitch, really appreciate the support. Um, and for, for uh, coming and checking out with me, I really, really appreciate you. Um, big thank you again to the publisher and their PR team for uh, sending over the key for it. So I was really, really excited to try it out. I'm looking forward to playing some more of it too. However, uh, for tomorrow's stream, I think we might possibly be returning to some Palea? Possibly. Because um, the event is coming to an end. I've been going back and forth like Palea, Nightingale, like, you know, uh, now, now garden life, what to do. But I know the event in Palea is coming to an end. I do want to buy some more stuff, spend some envelopes, so that might be good to do tomorrow. So yeah, assuming uh, everything's fine tomorrow, all good, no pain, anything like that, uh, that will be our plan for tomorrow's stream stream. In the meantime, whom we can we send some love to with a raid? If you don't mind sticking around for two moments longer, we're gonna send some love to someone over on Twitch. So I'm just checking to see who is live right now. Had fun, thanks Wade, thanks so much for being here. I really, really appreciate you friends. What do you have planned for your Thursday evening? Anything special? Hope it'll be nice and chill for you. All right. Um, maybe we can also look and see if anybody else is, is playing this game, quite possibly. Or, ooh, ooh. Let me uh, lower audio for a second. Just wanna get rid of ads, not kill any ear holes, that kind of deal. We'll, um, six now. Boop, 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 boop. we'll send some love to this person here. Okay, all right. Um, also, Ace, thanks so much for dropping those raid commands in chat. I appreciate you a lot. Guys, we're going on a good old Wade raid. Um, so if you'd like to come along on that Twitch raid, copy one of those raid commands in the Twitch chat. Uh, if you're a subscriber, you can copy the one with the animated emotes. Uh, but if you don't have our emotes, no worries at all. You can copy the one with the purple hearts, but make sure to copy one of them and paste it over in our raid targets chat once we get over there. And, oh boy. Um, let's send some love to... Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> um, perhaps this person? Mr. Baron. I'm struggling side and stuffs. I, I've got my eyes on someone to to raid. But I'm looking to see. Uh, um they went on a uh a BRB Hopefully they'll be back soon, because I do want to send some love to this person. That would be good. Okay, alright. Yeah, we'll we'll send some love to that person. Okay, alright. So, the person that we're going to raid right now, um, it's actually someone from our community. Their name is AD, um, aka a AD, the cow deity. So, I hope that you guys will join me in sending some love to AD. Um, like I said, they're on break right now, but I'm sure they'll be back any moment, and um, it'll be a nice surprise, um, I'm sure, for them to to have some friendios once they come back. Guys, I appreciate you friendios for being here for our stream today. I really appreciate you. It was such a cozy one, thanks to you. And um, I hope to see you for our stream stream tomorrow. Like I said, um, if all goes well, we'll be going live around 12 p.m. Eastern time, around noon. Uh, playing some more Palea, I think? Possibly? Possibly so? So I hope to see you then. 
in the meantime, get you some noms, get you some sleeps, have some sweet dreams, pet your fur beans, and uh, give some hugs to your loved ones. Really appreciate you being here, and I hope to see you for our stream trim tomorrow. Um, let's see, any other announcements? Uh, if you want to be part of our Discord, that's where we talk outside of stream trims, so that'd be super cool. And um, other than that, um, I do have a new YouTube video that went live today. Uh, it's the newest part of our Talos Principle 2 playthrough, so if you haven't checked that out yet, that'd certainly be appreciated too. Any subscribes to the channel over there, really, really appreciated. Thanks so much for the support, Iron Man. Nice to see you. Guys, I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day. Big thank you to my mods. And I'll see you later, friends. Take care.